If they make a fucking sequel to Cars with Human Heads, I'm on that shit day one. Oh, I've very strongly considered putting something about true Doom murderheads in my stream announcement. Uh, but I would have been too sad thinking about what happened to Barkley 2 if I did that. At least we still got the first one. Literally no clue what the stream announcement is about. I highly suggest you look up a little game called Hypnospace Outlaw.
Lily, let's go. Cool Punk will never come back. You have to move on. The accident wasn't your fault. that. Come on. What, are you gonna tell me Beef Brain is real next? Bursted with laughter over here. Importantly, goodbye. You fell for my trick. I got you so good. I, I literally got you so good. <laughs> Hi, welcome to the stream. Uh, good evening. Uh, good morning. Good afternoon. Maybe even good night, no matter where you are. Welcome. Uh, it is Tuesday, June 27th, 2023. Oh, it's time for fucking Slayer's X, baby. <laughs> I've been looking forward to playing this game for quite a while. And then the release date of it just kind of snuck up on me. 23 months. 24! That's so long, BWL. You forgot one! <laughs> Thanks for the resub. I've I've basically seen nothing about this video game. I played that one demo I played ages ago, and that's it. That's it. What potions to drink? <laughs> Thank you, Simple Ten, for the thirty-six months. Uh, I would recommend Quicksilver. And that's it. Thank you, Zerkwood, for the thirty-seven months. Let's kill some psychos, BWL. Oh, that's the fucking plan. <laughs> that's the plan. Um, I have been so, so goddamn excited uh, for this video game specifically because it combines uh, two, two dearly beloved interests of mine: um, retro shooters and hypnospace. <laughs> Is this game like The Sims? No. <laughs> Can't believe Zane is selling a Cataclysm mod on Steam. So? People sell fucking Doom mods. Pe people, people do that all the time. It's fine. It's cool. It's cool. Uh, I'm very excited again. Uh, I guess it's not really a sequel. In the same way that, like, uh, 
Dream Settler's gonna be a sequel. I guess, you know, mo more of a spin-off if you want to split hairs about it, but... All the same, I'm very excited about it. I am excited to see, uh, what, what bits and pieces and bobs we get and how we can play with it and cool rats we can look at and talk to, stuff like that. That's gonna- that's exciting. That's gonna be exciting. Um... I don't, I don't know if this stream is gonna- or if this game is gonna be like a one-stream game or a two-stream game. I know it's not terribly super long, but, um, I'm gonna have a good time all the same, I, I imagine. I hope all y'all tuning in do as well. Twenty. I sure is twenty. Thank you, Ofena. For the twenty months. Much appreciated. Does the game include the backstory of how it came to be in universe? Well, you see, when you play the video game and you watch, or if you watch someone play the video game, uh, information about the video game is conveyed to you. <laughs> so, <laughs> buckle your seatbelt, I guess. <sighs> hey, welcome to the stream. If you're new here and you like what we're doing and you haven't already, maybe consider hitting that follow button if you want uh, alerts on when we go live and stuff like that. Uh, you can follow me on Twitter if you want. You can follow me on Tumblr if you want. You can join my Discord if you want, if you want to get uh, stream notifications or if you want to chat with the community, stuff like 26 that. Months. Thank you, Flam, for the 26. Much appreciated. Uh, review the rules of the channel. Follow the rules. These streams are intended for mature audiences. Uh, keep that in mind. Be good to each other. Be good to yourself. Um, you have to do a perfect forward roll or you're banned. Um, it can be any kind of roll you want uh, through any technicality you can think of. But you gotta do one. Okay? It'd be fucking funny time for Mario to play. <laughs> When do you have to do it? I don't fucking know. I'm not your boss. I'm not your mom. <laughs> what do you want from me? <laughs> uh, we gotta talk about parallel universes. If you want to support the stream, I fucking forgot. I got waylaid. My entire train of thought sidetracked because File Select Mario 64 came up and my brain got so relaxed that I teleported to Jolly Roger Bay. I'm there now. I can see the boat. Thank you, trans girl Trish, for the 22 months. Much appreciated. 22. That's a lot of moths. It sure is. Also, I appreciate I it. Threw a dinner roll forward. Does that count? I don't know. Does it count? You fucking tell me. I'm busy. I'm streaming. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, hey, if you want to support the stream and everything we do here. <laughs> Uh, and you want to go the financial route? <laughs> you can subscribe to the chat. You can screw. You can screw sky bit. You can sasar bit. <laughs> it's a reoccurring monthly fee that gets you little emotes you can use here and all across Twitch and also on Discord if you join my server. Uh, you can give out gift subs to other folks. You can give bits. Uh, you can tip directly through Streamlabs and PayPal, uh, and I get a larger cut of the money that way if you want the most bang for your buck as far as me getting the money. Thank you, Archeo Angie, for the five gift subs. Much appreciated. Any and all financial support, always greatly appreciated. Never mandatory. No obligation. Never feel like you gotta. Look out for yourself first and foremost, but it is always very greatly appreciated. Uh, you know, this is this is my job. It's my source of income, and I'm able to say that because of the very generous support of viewers like you. Like viewers like Happy Frog Legs with a 31 3 sub. Thank you very much. And Narumali with 35 months. Thank you very much. Uh, these streams would not be what they are without the support of viewers like you. So thank you all very much. I think that's enough fucking about. I think that's enough faffin'. Um, what do you say we play a freaking video game? Um, and I haven't booted this up yet. So I apologize if it's loud. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I can't imagine it's going to be, like, deafeningly loud or anything, but... Uh, let's see. Any... Any second. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! 
go. When I was 16, I designed a computer game in this notebook, and it was awesome. But then it got lost. Or was it? <laughs> I am the X Slayer. I watch Holly Tone. Fucking awesome. <laughs> I'd like to formally apologize. I'd like to formally apologize. Um, every time I like talked about and posted about this video game today, this this afternoon, I was spelling it Slayer's X Terminal Aftermath Vengeance of the Slayer. I'd like to formally apologize, it is Vengeance of the Slayer. Crucially important. Vengeance of the Slayer. Don't forget, don't make my mistake. Um, I hope someday you can find it in your heart to forgive me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the streamer got it wrong. Post your BWLs, get it out of your system. <laughs> You know, this is the rare video game where, like, it's booted up, and I think it's a little too quiet. Let's make it a little louder. Zane volume. I'm tempted to put that to maximum, but... <laughs> I don't, I don't want to deafen people, but we do got to get the music louder. The, the fucking- the way the screen wiggles when you're trying to move the sliders is so funny! <laughs> because sometimes it'll slide back! This game owns. I'm awesome. Yes, you are, dude. Alright. Let's go with this. Let's go with this. Video. Uh, FOV 90. I'm fine with that. Brightness, sure. Uh... <laughs> I could turn V-Sync on, but I think screen tearing would be funny for a game like this. Uh, default, unlimited. Okay. Language. English. Gameplay. Uh, let's turn on auto run. Uh, hold. For. Um, run, I suppose. So I can hold to, to walk if I need to. Uh, invert, mouse, nah, nah. Sensitivity seems fine or whatever. If I need to adjust it in game, I can. Uh, head bob on. Gore? Normal? Extreme. <laughs> How we feeling, chat room? Extreme? I I'm feeling pretty extreme tonight. I think that's I think that's the play. I I think that's the move. <laughs> All right. No game to load. But I love the little Zane in the corner. Are there any your secret buttons I can press? Also, I love that the game is version Z for Zane. Alright. <laughs> Not a real gamer! <laughs> Normal gamer! I'm awesome! Or in Zane. People that have played this video game, how how difficult is Inzane? How how hard's that get? Uh, otherwise I'm feeling I'm awesome. Maybe I'll save Inzane for another playthrough. I'm awesome. Whoa, Zane. 
If you keep doing moves like that, I might let you go out with me. Jane, your hack blood power is growing. But you are not quite ready to yield its full power yet. What, Shannon? I am supposed to be up for my job at Sloppo's tonight. Get your butt in here now. <laughs> bye, I will come into work now, bye. I should quit. They don't pay me enough for this crap. Ouch. Have fun flipping burgers, Stephanie. <laughs> what? Breaking news! The Psycho Syndicate are blowing up bombs around famous CEO Zane Lofton's apartment. No! Cops are evacuating everyone in the city of Boise. <gasps> Stay safe, folks. I'll go check it out. Stay here. You're not ready. You are too weak. <laughs> My mom lives in that apartment. I don't care if I'm ready or not. I must fight! This just in, Psychos blew up Zane's mom when she was driving her car home. No. I... must... revenge her. <laughs> oh, this game's fucking awesome. No going back. Uh, I think I will turn down uh, cutscene volume just a just a little. <laughs> that was that was loud, but it was awesome. <laughs> okay. the The sensitivity is a little high, so I'm gonna turn that down to like one. There we go. Now we're talking. The computers are all busted. We have to defeat them for what they did to his mama. That's fucked up. You can't just do that. Thank you, Game Slayer Thirteen, for the thirty-seven month resub. Really fucking good username, I think. Considering what we're doing tonight. Yo, book? A map piece? How do you open up the map? Um, is there a button for seeing what my controls are? I guess M for map makes sense, yeah. Alright. That's where we are, that's where we're facing. I- I really enjoy Sloppos as, like, legally distinct parodying of- parodying of Boppos. That's good. We got the S-Blade. This is the S-Blade, Mikey Psyche's signature weapon. If the Yielder has 95 or more hack blood, it will become powerful. It uses one hack blood for each powerful shot, so use it wisely. The Yielder. <laughs> yeah, um, if you remember from Hypnospace, Boppos. And then here they have Sloppos. It's... <laughs> This it's 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 like you know when people back in the day would make like you know Burger King parodies and call them like Burger Kong or whatever kind of thing you know. <laughs> double pistols. These are the double pistols. They shoot fast and are accurate, but have to reload every fourteen shots. Only Zane can yield these pistols. No one else can do it. Glass blaster. This is the glass blaster. You use glass from broken windows to reload it. It's powerful up close. Awesome. I I, I think it's fun that the shotgun is just like, you, you get glass to, to load it up. Explosive sewage launcher. This is the sludge launcher. It shoots a can of Big Z explosive sludge and also attracts rats to come help fight. Rats are the X-Slayer's greatest allies. Dude, rats are so cool. The Rapid Mutator. This is the Rapid Mutilator. Oh, Mutilator. It's a chainsaw, so I it does that. extra damage up close. And if you point it down and shoot, you can even fly a little bit. Awesome. Dude, I love to fly a little bit. Triple Helix Missile Launcher. This is the Triple Helix Missile Launcher. It shoots three rockets at a time. This is Stephanie's favorite weapon. Hey, good for her. Hackblood Talisman. This is 
The Hackblood Talisman. It is only used by the most powerful Hackblood Masters. It is a mystery. Uh, someone in chat saying that that's not a chainsaw and it's a different kind of saw, it's a rotary saw. You, you don't understand. You don't understand nothing. You don't understand. You don't get it. In case of emergency, break the glass. Yo. Oh my god. <laughs> Even your body is a billboard, it's right. Let's go! <laughs> this game is good! The little army man. Uh, in that case, maybe music down a little bit. That was a little loud, but in case of emergency, break. Right I'm incredible. All right, so it begins. Owie! Owie! This is the rest of the stream. We're just talking to the rats. I hope they haven't taken out that trash bin yet. We got your back, Bane! Oh, I'll eat just about anything, really. People think it's super cool. You're awesome, Bane! This game is fucking great just on the basis that it understands rats are good. Free pizza for all, President Zane declares. <laughs> Thank you, Nightmare Judge, for the resub. I'm so excited to play this. X slays help old woman across the street. Zane, CEO hero. Get that glass. My glass now. The microwave. <laughs> Grizzly. Fifty cents. What a rip off. Just shoot it. I don't have any change. Just smash it. <laughs> I don't have any change. Just smash it. Awesome. <sighs> ring, ring. Beep. Welcome to the X-Slayer hotline. Leave a message. But if you're a psycho, shove a turd up your bunghole. Ring, ring. Hello? Just kidding. The psychos messed up the phone lines. <laughs> ring, ring. If any psychos are listening, tell them Zane's coming to shove his pistols where the sun don't shine, which is up their butts. Dude. This game's a masterpiece. Ring, ring. Hello? Oh, you're a hot supermodel? Okay, yes, we can go out after I blow up the psychos. Ring, ring. Beep. Welcome to the X-Slayer hotline. Leave a message. But if you're a psycho, shove a turd up your bunghole. <laughs> Video games are awesome. Oh, hey, Zany. Video games are good. The beginning. In case you forgot, uh, the original comics, the origins of the X Slayers. Yes, I am powerful, but I am a good guy. Come outside, say now! <laughs> I'm still obsessed with the way voila is spelled. Just voila. <laughs> this is what Zane got up to after getting banned from Hypnos- No! These were all posted on Hypnospace. This game was made in 1998, and they never finished it. They only finished it, like, this year. It was just like lying in a box on a CD. From years and years ago. The Steel Sewer. We have every single gun, machine gun, machine gun, sword, and RPG in the world. We have every instrument in every video game and movie. There's even a soda machine. But for now, we must talk.
<laughs> your secret powers and double pistols. All of it is real. Let's kick some psycho ass. I wish I could jump up here. Wait, if you look out high enough, you can see Zane's hair! <laughs> oh, I'm, I am enamored with this game. I'm so charmed by this. We've, like, barely seen anything, and I'm already delighted by everything. Oh my god, look out! You're just lucky I didn't kick you in the nards! <laughs> hey, bro. Oh. You want, you want to come with us? You're a little fancy. There's goodies here. Can't shoot it from here. Maybe another way. <laughs> Zane. The psychos. <laughs> they found the steel sewer. <laughs> Our secret base. Okay. They know about the hack blood. You must stop them. I give you the S blade. Cool. Thanks, man. <laughs> Whatever you do, Zane, don't let them get the hack blood talisman. Go to the steel sewer and get it before they do. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and one last thing. I am your... Mikey, no! <laughs> the S-Blade has a hack blood charge. Like the Half Life mouths in the cutscenes is so good, and then just cool. Thanks, man. <laughs> for the retub. <sighs> Can I shoot them like this? Yes, does that do anything? Unknown. Anyways, <laughs> they're rotating. <laughs> Technology is amazing. Can I shoot this? Seemingly no, but... No, okay. Off we go. Cube? Washing machine? <laughs> Sorry Zane, your game is very cool, but I just, just want to jump on shit. Oh, hole. Whoa! I found a secret! Hey, man! Now, how do I get in there? Ashlayers are awesome! I know you got this under control, but still. Oh, I, I can just walk it. Slayers hate the psychos, it's true, but can we really trust the X Slayers? Bring me some cheese. Really fucking good voice. Really fucking good Rat King voice. Everyone agrees, rats are now awesome. Hey, ow. Where is the cheese, I wonder? Hey, man. Where'd you. Gone? Okay. Hmm. Well, if we find the cheese, we find it. If we don't, that's fine. Oh, is the Red King done by Rosie D? That's funny. You were lame. This is a fun junkyard. Silly smiling. The 
Chest Blade has a hack blood charge. Oh, hang on. Bouncing? Bouncing? Dude, bouncing? This game's got bouncing? This game's got glass blast on. Loading with broken glass for junkyard personnel use only. For self defense. Hey, a burger! Sloppo's burger, yummy! so cute. And I mean that as the highest compliment possible. Oh, wrong thing. I thought I could get glass from that. Oops. Oh, those blow up too. Fun, 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 fun. Don't step in the fire, it hurts you. Main office. I thought for a second that was the receptionist. No, they were bad. Ring, ring. Hello? Just kidding. The psycho's messed up the phone lines. <laughs> Thank you, Earthling Plant, for the reset. Don't forget to wipe! <laughs> Why are they wiggling? The Queen of Sardines! <laughs> Rest in peace, Frank Taylor, 1954 to 2018. Miss you, loser. I'm too late to make your music famous, but I did put some of it in level 7. Hope you're not driving Aunt Sharon crazy up there with your big garbage bags full of crap. Bursting with laughter. Love you, man. Aw, that's sweet. Aw. <laughs> Just like Hypno's face, in that I am. I love the way that you get, like, you know, some, like, this really, like, heartfelt, sweet little character moment in its own way. Directly next to, like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking pussy joke. <laughs> it's awesome. If you're that ugly, I do not want to see your mama. There. Uncle Frank's big dumps. Yo, good work, Uncle Frank. I want to get in there. I want to get in there so bad. I want to get in there so bad. How do I get in there? Hey. Straight up, let me in there. Yes, Blade has a hack blood charge. I want to go in there so bad. Oh, this is the wrong way. I have to go this way. It's a fun visual effect. Welcome to Uncle Frank's Big Dumb. I bet that's like actually his uncle and that like, hang on. I gotta double check the name. Sorry, I'm getting shot at. Yeah, this whole thing is like a tribute to his actual uncle. Aw. That's awesome. You just remembered this is live? Sure is, baby. I'm putting you on blast, specifically. Yeah, we're camping here. We escape and trying to be good in hard, don't shoot. What did I do? Eat it, dipweed. We gotta go back. We gotta go back. We gotta go back. We have to set things right.
We have to fix it. We have to fix it. We have to make things better. We have to make things better. We have to be better. <laughs> the big sloppo shine over there. Shine? Sign. But it can't be Whoa! Here. There we go. Now I guys. found a secret. We still have to find wherever the cheese is, but yeah, the little the little hut icon goes opens its mouth when you jump. It's cute. So we're over here. I see, I see. Let's see, we're going this way. Eat a burger. Delicious Sloppo's burger. Pretty good shotgun, even if the sound doesn't necessarily have, like, the same oomph uh, as some other shotguns. Hang on! Nasty pits. I just noticed that. Super smooth tissue is delicious. But, you know, it, it's, it's got some good oomph to it. It's got some good heft. It made that guy explode into gore. Hey, man, where you going? You smell like turds. <laughs> well, not more, cause you're dead. It's really that simple. It's really that simple. You gotta help. Okay. Let's go back here. Let's save our game. All right. We escape and trying to be good in hard, don't shoot. Psycho. Hey, man. Keep on keeping up. Poo poo's orange turds extra nasty. Let's go. <laughs> Alright, the timeline is restored as it should be. Oh? Oh, that's where we started! That's fun, that's fun. I wonder if there's like a speedrun trick to zoop your way up there right from the start. Where does this go? Where the fuck does this go? Why am I able to go this far? Wait, are these guys also supposed to be friends? Hang on. Let's try loading our game, we'll see. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge! Dude, that's awesome. I'm so happy for you. Okay. Let's see if these guys will try shooting us if we don't shoot them. Why are people saying rabbit? What? I didn't notice. There's like a baby tall there. Hang on. Uh, I've watched Gianni and Scorpy play this, and Holly is the first one you've seen who did shoot them. I'm... well, I'm me. I'm not other people. And also, these games turned me into a fucking animal. So... Listen, I'm all about that rip and tear lifestyle. You know how it is. Or maybe you don't, but you're about to. Okay, these guys are shooting at me. These You're guys get no mercy. I'm gonna kick you in the nards. These guys are crippling. These guys are the evil guys. These are the bad, 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 damn bad. Fuck them. Hey, man. What you doing? You having fun? You're just a little guy. You're just a buddy. You're a straight up friend and an animal. 
열어보세요. Now what happens if I? <laughs> what happens if I? <laughs> <laughs> hey, if you like rabbits, don't look. <laughs> it was evil! It was evil! It was self-defense? No, 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 no. It was evil. It was straight up a psycho. Even the rabbit gets in trouble if they're part of the psycho syndicate. Hey, I saw that spinning up there, damn it. I flubbed my jump. Well, this is gonna be the next uh, 50 hours or so with the stream. Uh, at about hour 20, people are gonna start guessing that I'm doing it on purpose, and they're right. Well, that one was my mistake. Maybe I should just walk instead of run. I keep slipping right off the corner bit there. I keep not hitting jump early enough. Platforming in this game is hard. Well, yeah, it's, it's an old retro shooter. It's not a, it's not a fucking platformer. People used to love for like their Doom mods and uh, other things like that, you know? Putting in jumping puzzles when like that game was never meant for jumping puzzles, even if the devs put their own jumping puzzles in it. Anyways! Whoa! I found a secret! Fuck yeah. We can fly. Retention ponds, aka crap pond. Hey. I'll tell your mom that I you up when I get with her. <laughs> Game has the built-in defense of if it sucks, you can just claim that it was on purpose because it was made by Zane and his programmer. <laughs> I mean, they're they're very intentionally doing the whole like it's it's like a shooter of the era with all its warts. I think that's fun. Oh wait a second. There's like a bit back over here. I think I'm in the damn wet water. Hey, but I totally missed, so I'm going back.
dude. We can have so much fun and play in here. Where'd you go? Oh well. Uh oh. Don't go there. Was just thinking today how much you wanted to watch me play this game? Well, hey, good news. I scheduled to play this game today. <laughs> they got the meats. They got the meat. But do they got cheese? Dude, we're gonna get so many glass shards. This is awesome. Ring, ring. Beep. Welcome to the X Slayer Hotline. Leave a message. But if you're a psycho, she shove called a out two hole. times last week. We'll be fired soon. Uh oh. Owie. Hey. <laughs> Gross. Take that, you mother flipping turd pile. What are those? They look weird brains. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. It's fine. Under there, is there? Oh, I want to see a place. Hmm. Looks like no. Okay. Still no cheese. Ring, ring. Hello? <laughs> Just kidding. The psychos messed up the phone lines. Oh, glass. Oh, glass. Thank you. I want as many sharks as I can hold. Oh, you should not be standing in and shooting the deep fat fryer, dude. That's so bad to do. It's so bad when you do it. <laughs> bad employee of the month. Sexy both on and offline. <laughs> I'm awesome. Sexy both on and offline. Awesome. Wait, yeah, that isn't the middle finger. That's the ring finger. All over the floor, dude? Good luck with that now. P.S. I made out with your mom last night. <laughs> I'm awesome. <laughs> Kids world! Dude, I'm loving the toy this month. toy this month. <laughs> they tried to hide it with the dollar shaver boxes. The S blade has a hack blood charge. Oh, it doesn't. Where'd it go? It took it. Owie. Oh, you lose it when you take damage. Oh. It's like Doom Armor. I see, I see. I'm understanding, I'm learning, I'm growing. Fun zone? Tiny, tiny golf. I can't wait to play tiny golf. Uh, I'm gonna assume this is the end of the level, right? Oh, 
What if you go the wrong way? Evacuate now! There's a psycho attack! Boise PD! <laughs> Blade has a hack blood charge. Yo. More invisible walls ahead. <laughs> PWL. Awesome. You're lame. Whoops. Oh, back here. Damn. Well, back the way we came. Sniff around for anything else hidden around here. So there is still the whole. Oh, hang on, there's also this. Oh, it just leads here. Okay. Delicious sardines. Because there's still the whole bit that was like, what, over here? No, I don't think this is the type of game to go, oh, you just have to get the collectible and we'll be your friends and then not make the collectible. Like, oh, it literally just rings back around here. Okay, cool. I didn't have to go around the long way I did. <laughs> That's funny. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure it is, in fact, a collectible you can get. I just haven't found it. That's fine. I ain't here to do a 100% run on my first go-through. I'm just here to have fun and shoot psychos. Smells bad down here! I love it! Hello? Is this thing on? Turd burger, di diarrhea burger, pig butthole sausage, fried teared nuggets, fries and soft drink. Excuse me, I need to order 100 Sloppo Dogs for my rat friends. They love eating turds, which is what Sloppo Dogs taste like. Anyone there? I'm still waiting for my dogs. Never mind, your food is even too nasty for rats. Bye, idiots. Hello? I know you can't Is this thing on? Control, but still, I just love to help. <laughs> <laughs> the rats are good. The rats are good. Oh. Big dogs. Dude, this stream is so sponsored by Big Dumps. Oh, I thought this was a hole. I got excited. The standing on here doesn't get me anything. Sorry I'm treating your game like a jungle gym, but I guess I'm doing it in the jungle gym area, so it's fine. Okay, let's, let's exit the level. There's a bunch of secrets that we haven't found. But that's okay. I wonder where the cheese was. This is like in one of these damn vans or something. I've got ammo in here. What's my favorite video game rat? I don't know enough video game rats off the top of my head to have an answer to that. Just ratatouille. There we go. Come closer next time, I'll kick you in the nards. What are these dudes? They lined up so nicely for me. That was so polite. These dudes are literally so polite. <laughs> ah, there we go. This way. There's this place. Whoa! I found a secret! 
That's awesome, dude. Thanks for feeding us friends all the time, Bane. We love you! Yippee! Can I... Yes! Yes, I can. Ooh, baby. Now we're cooking with something or other. Cussing key? I mean, we're kind of doing cusses. We're going like, you know, turd and butthole and ass and stuff. I don't actually know. Remember if he said ass? This is the family apartments where the families live. Does it have a middle finger key? Hang on. What's the middle finger key? <laughs> middle finger at all. You lied to me. No vigilante activity from X-Layers. Cop guns are better than your green energy idiots. Boise PD. <laughs> I <can't. laughs> I do gotta get up for a break, so I'm gonna do that. Uh, enjoy the awesome sound of the rain uh, while I get up and have a stretch. Maybe do the same for yourself. I'll be back in a couple minutes.
Hello? What the fuck are you all doing to my bot? Settle down. You're like a horde of fucking ducks being shown a tiny bowl of peas. I can't believe it. <laughs> How y'all doing? <laughs> I, I find usually when I end up playing games like this, it's a little bit hard for me to juggle playing the game and also glancing at the chat room and talking to people. Um, I hope y'all been enjoying the stream so far. Uh, this game's fucking great. <laughs> I'm very excited uh, for more of it, which is why I'm going to play more of it right now. Uh, I guess I should save my game. I haven't done that in a while. Save game. You forgot what the S what the S blade has? Good news. It's got nothing. It's got a cool look to it. That's really about it. Can I jump up here? No, because then I'd just be able to jump across. Wait, unless... Wait, wait, we're in the money? Oh, we're stuck now. And there was an invisible wall. Damn, I got so excited. Can I, can I do that again? Oh, no, there's also an invisible wall that slides you off. Okay. Well, that's still cool. <laughs> Thank you, Atrab, for the 20-month resub. Much appreciated. What? Oh, it's just particle effects. Okay, I thought someone tried to snipe me from far away. Man, between Sign getting to do, like, the, the like, cover art for this and Atrab... Uh, doing work in uh, Dream Settler. It's it's so fucking cool seeing like people from the community uh, popping off and getting to work on cool things like that. Like, dude, I can't even like claim to have a part in that. It's just exciting to see. Toilet. <laughs> Tell you when I was visiting this weekend, Mom huh? suddenly said do it, and then continued as if nothing happened. What? Oh yeah. Why did Mom do that? Mom doesn't know what Ui is. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> thanks for the <laughs> thanks for the tip. Yo! It's potato month. Let's go. I like the way it jiggles. Awesome. Awesome. Peanut cutter snacks. J why? What is scratched out? Psycho's bread? <laughs> you can even blow up the chips. Get glass from this. Hi, sorry I broke your stuff and pooped. Wrong house. Forgive me, <laughs> Psycho. Awesome. Psycho's I wish I could hold my nose, but I'm holding weapons. It smells like a ball of turds mixed with sardine buttholes. Awesome. Oh my god. Dude, video games are good. You smell like turds. Video games are good again. <laughs> well, not anymore. Cause you're dead. I love the fucking green stink explode. <laughs> Dude, they had some poopy -poo blasts in here. Well, I'm glad I found this. Look at this. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> These dudes are having the time of their fucking life here. It's too bad they're part of the Psycho Syndicate. 
could have had so much fun in losing a little piece. Glass, glass shards in the fridge. What else is around here? Uh, a bra? Uh, come on, man. That's a little crass, don't you think? The CDs. The poster. Cool bed. Another bra on it. <laughs> what exactly is this game? What do you mean? It's a, it's a first-person shooter. Uh, specifically, it is a spin-off of Hypnospace Outlaw made in-universe by one of the characters from Hypnospace. Alright, I do have to go this way. Okay. And you can jump up and down. And you can play and play. Is this a Hypnospace spin-off? Yeah! Do you remember the fucking comics that Zane made? This is a video game that he was working on based off his comics with one of his friends in, like, 1998. Where was the stairs again? Oh, right, just here. Or we can go in here. There's shoes here. Oh no, we cannot go in here. Jiggle it. Now, how did I get up there? I've already forgotten. That's how I got down. I'm so bad at navigating, I've already forgotten where I was and how to get there. Oh right, I just did this. That's what I did. That is in fact how I got it. The poo everywhere. Oh, let's get here. The green. Penguins! Home sweet home. Or, it used to be. Rip mom. Aww. This was, uh, my mom's. I miss her. Aww. Rip, Mom. You were the best mom a kid ever had. Miss you, Mom. I wonder if this is, like... I wonder if in-universe his mom is, like, also passed away. Like, it, it, it does feel like that. It, it, it... That, that feels like what the voice lines are going for, given how, like, he sounds everywhere else. Man. Rip, Mom. Man. And then you go and you blow up the toilet. Part of me is expecting this game to be a lot of goofy haha -ha joke times, and part of me is expecting this game's gonna hurt. I mean, more than it already has, and just the little bits that it has. So that's exciting. I I do love that skull. It's a good skull. Primo skull in this game. Break this mirror again in the next level. Whatever. <laughs> There's like a little, little playground set back there. Pro <laughs> Professor Pooper? I am the x -Layer. Oh, I didn't mean to fall into that. Damn. Pretty good, though. I did it a little slow. <laughs> Level two. This is the one I played in the demo, I think, right? Whoa! I found a secret! <laughs> nice. Squisher sucks! Oh, this really is a game! <laughs> Made by a kid in the 90s, huh? You just let us know what you need. 
We're rats. <laughs> Fuck Pokemon and Teletubbies. I need everyone to know my stance on those in the middle of my cool in the middle of my cool mod. Wonder if you can get out there. I don't remember if I did in the demo I played. I see like a super right there though. My guns again. My cool computer. Oh shit! It's fucking Taurus! Cataclysm. Why did I just break that? What am I doing? Uh, why am I breaking my own stuff? <laughs> Number one hacker. Why can't I stop busting up my junk? <laughs> it won't budge. <laughs> What game console is this? L Lame Champ Ultra CD. What is wrong with me? World Champ. Number one karate. Stop it! No! That cost me an entire paycheck! Oh, you get an achievement for that. That's cute. That's fun. <laughs> <laughs> I think I have a problem. Why did I just break that? I think what I have a problem. I uh, <laughs> why am I breaking my own stuff? Mom, if you are reading this, you found my secret room. Don't push the button. This is not a secret elevator. Surprise! I was making you a walk-in closet to fit extra clothes. Happy Mother's Day. Oh. <laughs> I guess this just calls it up if it goes down or something. Like, yeah. Had to know. Had to know. Well, rip to those jeans, but. Normal sewer ahead! Your mom's dumb! <laughs> the lights are on. What if I came back here with an exploder? It smells so bad in here, it makes my armpits smell like a girl's perfume. And they normally smell like B.O. Oh, this music is fun. There we go. Whoa, I found a secret. Hey, man. Ah. They're a beautiful family. How cute. Oh, that's so sweet! <laughs> Ouch! The S Blade has a hack blood charge! <laughs> it's got a little toilet mobile! That's so funny! Stop. The sewer is boring. Do not keep on going. Alright, guess I'll stop. Oh. I do like the way the moving around feels in this game. I've had a hankering to play uh, an old style shooter kind of like this for a while now, so. Glad this is uh, ticking a lot of boxes in that regard and not just being like, you know, uh, Looks funny, sounds funny, plays okay, kind of thing. Uh, sewer control panel! Poop, urine, diarrhea, spit, vomit, and other, all overloading. <laughs> hey, ouch. But you don't want to know about that other. That other is when things get real scary. Left the key to this door in my office. You don't want to know about number three. Psycho's busted up our hack blood pipes. Now the poo is coming alive. That's messed up. That's messed up. We can't let them get away with this.
That's not okay. Alright, that's the secret entrance. We'll go back there in a sec. There's other goodies here. Left the key to this door in my office. Okay, so we do have to go to the office for that. That I remember. Vaguely. What else is here, though? Uh, jumping puzzle? Pretty stupid. <laughs> I'm obsessed! I'm obsessed! Blowing a guy up and going... It's kind of dumb. This game's great. Can I... Jump on this? Whoa! I found a secret! Whoa. Ah. But I want to jostle my way in there. Hey, hey, any second now? Any second now? Damn. I blew up poop. That's what matters. Can you see if this is on the other side? Maybe there's like something there. I don't remember what that bit was. Maybe this is like a comeback later to this part kind of thing. Like vaguely remembering. I wait, I can use the chainsaw to jump! That's true! Okay, let me be on top of this. There we go. I forgot there's the chainsaw jump. Owie! Oh right, this is just an exit. Well, let's go for it. <laughs> to main sewer control room. Let's do that again, but like the way they want me to. Instead of sequence breaking. <laughs> That's fun that you can do that if you get that though. Ouch! <laughs> there we go. Not for wusses or mama's boys. You're not a mama's boys, are you, Chuck? The psychos were here. Oh, you can probably, like, go that way if you're doing the speedrun of it, I bet. The sludge launcher. New from the genius mind of Zane. <laughs> the S Blade has a hack blood charge. Thank you, Finari, for the four-month resub. What the heck type of gun is this? Funny ass this beautiful game. <laughs> this is Slayer's X. I'm awesome. Uh, it is the spin-off slash kind of sequel to Hypnospace Outlaw. I know. Your grandparents are turds. I need a key to open this door. It's time for the Rhino Roundup. Oh. Well. <laughs> Free sludge. The rats are friendly! A key. Sexy both on and offline. Reminder. Stop forgetting your key cards in the secret X Slayer bathroom. Time to look for the bathroom. The number one company in Boise. <laughs> Explosive sludge. Rats love it. Is there anything else in here? Any other goodies? This is storage. I need a key to open this door. Different key card for that. You live in Boise? Can't confirm I need Big a key to everywhere? open this door. That's awesome. Good for him. Alright, let's 
go back this way. Oh, three blocks. We got the blaster. Game of the game. Burger. No explosive near this wall. Thanks. No psychos in hidden passage. Psychos will get blown up on sight. <laughs> the restrooms. Alright. Normal person restroom. X Slayer restroom. Psycho restroom. Blade has a hack blood charge. Ouch! One more, though. Yes, Blade has a hack blood charge. It's time to chew ass and shoot through wires. Fuck! Oh, that's fun. <laughs> Thank you, Gianni, for that one. Alright, so. This is the restroom for psychos. Not a trap. You're dead. It's a good thing we're not uh, part of the Psycho Syndicate. Oh, yes, no, no, Blade has a hack blood charge. No, 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 this one. Yes, Blade has a hack blood charge. Good news about the S Blade, by the way. It's a good thing that we're not part of the Psycho Syndicate. Normal person restaurant. I'm awesome. Now. X Slayer restroom. Sexy both on and offline. The trial of the deuce. Now this I forgot about. I'll tell your mom that I blew you up when I get with her tonight. Red key. I can't blow up this toilet. That's a shame. Wait, wait. Hang on. I'm Whoa! I found a secret. X Slayer training. Oh, the rats train there. <laughs> That's fun. Hey guys. What if I make more of you? Does this make more rats? I think it makes more rats, right? Or it makes them go towards it. There you go. See? They want it. They want in. They want in. That's basically pretty awesome. I spent my whole life hoping I'd meet you one day. You're even taller in person. That's awesome. <laughs> I do love the rats. They're a lot of fun. Okay, so we gotta go back now. Uh, to use that key card. Psychos was here, so be careful. Uh, this has a fun texture to it. A, a lot of the graphics from, like, Hypnospace, and also in this game I'm noticing, or at least, like, right here, have, like, 
really, really fun dithering like this, and I, I don't know, I really like that. I, I, I'm, I'm delighted by it. It's good dithering. All right. Goodies. Oh wait, there's totally a book there. Hang on. Map piece. Ah. I see, I see. Hey, we found four out of six. Nice. That's a pretty good track record so far. Hacked by Psycho's x suck. Okay, there was also the one room over back at the base, which was this way. Right? Yeah, this way. Jay knows how to dither? He sure goddamn does. Like, like, you know, the whole this game was made by Zane bit aside, like, the, the people who worked on this game did some, like, real fun fucking work. Where was the secret room again? Storage here. Right, here. There we go. If you were that ugly, I do not want to see your mama. Shooting cans at him. Ow. Cans on ya. <laughs> oh, the guitar don't survive though. Hack blood pool and break room. Go for a dip. Blood is dangerous if you if you're not trained. Can I not eat the the, the, the gross nasty pizza? Ooh. What? The hack blood talisman? The psycho stole it? Oh, this is bad. Uh oh. This is very very bad. It's okay though, because we can totally walk into this, right? We can walk into this and not get hurt. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. And hey, Ouch. the S Blade has a ha Oh, the fire. Right, the fire. Right, the fire to be careful of the burning fire. Yo. Look at this cool place. That's fun. That's fun. I'm a sucker for uh, digital hacker type of space as like cool geometry in the sky. It's uh, very often a fun look, IMO. Burger. <laughs> Stephanie works at Sloppo's in the day and blows psychos up at night with her triple whistle launcher. Hey! Pretty I'm reading! Stupid. Pretty stupid. Mikey Psyche, the first X Slayer. He's a hack blood master and shoots hack blood beams with his hands. Zane, the coolest X Slayer. Young and, in and inexperienced, but has secret powers he does not yet know. <laughs> I love putting that on a plaque on a sign! I look good in gray. It's. <laughs> this, this game is so good at capturing, like, yeah, this is what, like, a. A teen would think was cool as fuck if they were like an edgy teen type of dude. Steph, a true X Slayer. I must find her. I must find her. Steph, a true rest in peace, Mikey. You were the most powerful hack blood master. No one could defeat you. Wow, the sprite rotating is so good. Until now. I love the sprite rotating, it's so fun. I look good in gray. <laughs> Training dojo. Slayers express the training dojo. <laughs> Tram out of order, psychos blew up the tunnel, <laughs> idiots. <laughs> 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 
Skilly bop 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 Oh hey! I thought we could get back here. In universe, the actual Mikey Psyche found out about this project and let Zang use his songs for this? That's fun. That's fun. I didn't. I, I think I remember hearing, like, something about that. Oh, this is the. Okay, I see. This is more of the level. And we got a map piece. Let's go back down the sewer. Back down the damn sewer. Explore some more. There's more to discover here. Um, right, because there's that whole bit, like, out here. Piles of poop. I got what was in here. It's in here. There's that bit that exploded. We got the map bit. Um, and this all just goes here. This takes us to the tram. I don't remember if this hurts or not, but I have a feeling. Home of the X-Layers. Express to restrooms. Oh, right, the fire. Got you, mother flipper. Can I go in there? Probably not. It's a good thing we can jump out of this hole. Oh, it does just take us back here. Okay, that's cute. <laughs> I see, I see. Alternate path. Alternate route. Uh... Out we go, then. Let's keep going. Ball. Ball. Yo, yeah, do you mind? Let me wait a sec. Enough of shooting at me? Ball. I mean, the ball's being a little mean to me, but... Ball. Dude, ball! Uh, no diving. But I'm doing just fine. Maybe it's because I'm awesome. Ain't my weapons dipweed. Dipweed. Ball? Where'd our ball go? Did I did I break the ball? Was that why he was talking about? Wait, no, they, there it is. Maybe it looks like a normal ball, but it's not. It's a psycho ball. This flippin' ball. I can't kill it. <laughs> oh no! I will destroy this ball. If it's the last thing I do, I will destroy this ball. If it's the last thing I do. <laughs> I love the backflip they do sometimes when you blow them up. There we go. Please, Zane. Oh, hey, Zany. <laughs> I keep forgetting I have this fucking can launcher now. Oh, 
I love these dudes. The S blade has a hack blood charge. There we go. There we go. Now we're cooking. <laughs> what are these like, skulls just floating around like that? They're like seagulls. Yo, hang on, that's the dollar shaver. That's the dollar shape. That's the dollars haver. Employees only. Well, we're not employed here, are we? No. Zane is a a, a a dollar shaver CEO or, or something like that, isn't he? He's something or other. Let's go. He's allowed in. I am the X Slayer. He's the CEO of anything forever, so. 104%? <laughs> Manager, that's the word I was looking for, thank you. Very different from CEO, now that I think about it. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge. Dude, good news about the S-Blade. It won't budge. I can't open it. Uh, laundry man, ah. profits, hey. Bouncy, bouncy. You just messed with the wrong X-Blade. Anyways, thank you full cap for 28 months. Laundry mat, Calvin. Owie! I can't fucking stand these guys. Laundry mat profits last week 4,300 quarters, 2,280 dimes, 3,240 nickels, 5,934 pennies. Total money, $3 million. Dude, the dollar shaver's doing great in this economy. Alright, Matthews. Here we are. You love to see it. More pistols. Do the coin the coins totally have Zane's face on them. The coins absolutely have Zane's face on them. That's so funny. It won't budge. <laughs> Door busted, go around front. Okay. If you insist. There you go. Bye. Ooh, oh, this music is going places, isn't it? Hello. Now we're fucking talking. Well, this one's okay, but I kind of want the other one back. <laughs> there we go, there we go. Lunch sucker. Eat at work for free. So your manager can make you work even off the clock. <laughs> Paints a bit of a dire picture. This is great. Hey, mine, I'm opening stuff up. I'm getting glass shards. Oh, no, I'm not. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Attention all employees. This is your boss, Levin. You're all getting $10 raises. Also, I'm a flippin' moron, Mevin out. Man, fuck Mevin, for real. Attention all shoppers. I like to make love to my truck. My parents got me this job because they own the place. Also, I'm a loser. Bye. Man, fuck Mevin, for real. Attention customers. It's store manager Mevin here. If you smell something weird smelling, it's just my bomb that I keep under my desk because I like to huff my own turds. There's a bong in this? There's a bong in this? Attention all employees. This is your boss, Mevin. You're all getting $10 raises. Also, I'm a flippin' moron. We gotta Mevin find that bong. Out. We gotta find that bong. We gotta find that bong. 
Zane knows what a bong is? Yeah, he's in like his 30s, isn't he? Eat my weapons, dickweed. Of course he knows what a dang bong is. I will kill again! Ouch! Hang on. Uh, get better someday. Oh well, it happens. Charge. Dude, I would love to buy three get one. I I love all the weird like Halloween -y bits and like October stuff that we see. Attention all shoppers! I like to make love to my truck. My parents got me this job because they own the place. Also, I'm a loser. Bye! Casey Mongillo submitted a balloon design for this. I have no clue who that is. I have no idea who that is. I'm an awesome trucker, it looks like. Cool truck. Truck pick. I need a key to open this door. Haha! <laughs> He's got the skull bong! He's got the skull bong! <laughs> Well, that's my glass shark now. Termination notice. Reason. He kicked me in the nards one time and I cried like a little wuss. Termination notice. Reason. In in some board nation. Rebellion. Talking smack. Not working. Being evil. What the hell is that? Oh? Hang on. Mevin's to do. Have some fun with my sexy new friend in Fun Zone hotel room. Finish secret area under my office. Snort turds because I'm a loser. I need a key to open this door. I need a key to open this door. Oh, but I want the key now. What do we got on the shelves? Ball? Damn ball. Uh, more rhinos. Uh, super gun? Some kind of superhero looking motherfucker? Little army men? Handcuffs? Uh, wrestle boss? Uh, that's what my brain has decided that one says. <laughs> Something crap butt legs. More nasty pits. Ah. You think you're twisted? Guess again. There we go. That's something. What's in here? Well, that. Oh, okay. Just the way it came. I see, I see. What if there was more, though? No, okay. I gotta figure out how to get into that in the back room. Those don't break, those don't break. Just the toilets. I take a drink. Ran a damn train through here. Spiders. You can blow each one up individually. They just explode into like chips or something. Wait, wait! Taurus? Uh. Grey Guy? Gumshoe Gooper? Dropsy? Um. Straight up fucked up dudes that I'm passing the blunt with. Um. Whatever you are. You're made of blood and meat. 
All of these are full of meat. Awesome. <laughs> Psycho's bread. Alright, out we go. Okay, hey. I hear that fart. I hear that pooping. Here we go. More sewage launcher. It won't budge. Okay, so we can't open this. Oh god, I'm I'm fucking digging this tune. It's so good. It's Does the S blade have a hack blood charge? Um, let's find out. I just got a really good deal on plane tickets for my mom, and I smile. The S blade has a hack blood charge. Good news. Employees only get the sludge can. Employees only get a sludge can. Who said that? Oh, it's the plan. <laughs> hey, thanks for the tip. I appreciate it. Congrats. Break right on the hole. It's so sad what happened to the shopping cart. Don't let it happen to you. <laughs> what a lame baby. <laughs> what a lame baby. <laughs> Dude, these guys are really friggin' idiots. I hit them like once with the sword and they're just gone. Like... And they call themselves a syndicate. Bill Puke Soda! Farter's Market? Boner's Ferry? <laughs> Big Pine Estates? Wildlife safety, potato. I'm I'm digging that potato festival potato. More pistol. We got beers back here. Yummy yama. The chips. Hey, what happens if I? Just that. Okay. I was expecting more and bigger. Boise Fall Potato Festival, next right. Can I jump over that fence? Let me up, let me up, let me up. Let me up, let me... Was I hoping for the Left 4 Dead gas station explosion? Literally, yes. It set the standard for gas station explosions in video games. Let me, let me up. I was able to go out before. How did I do it? There we go. Whee! Aha! I think this is literally somewhere you are meant to go, but it, I, yeah, there's just an entrance there. Mevin, what are you doing out here? I, I thought they evacuated town. I don't know, Zane. I could ask you the same question. I hope your mom knows you're out past your little bedtime. I would fire you if I wasn't banging her. Shut up, idiot! My mom! She was blown up by cycles while driving her car! What? Those idiots! I told them not to, uh... To, well, well, gotta run. Uh-oh! What did he do? Mevin! Mevin, you were a really messed up loser! How could you? I missed what that tip said, but thank you. Oh, I've already looked up and seen, like, bits in my head. It's cute, it's fun. Thanks for the tip. Alright, how do I get to mini golf? Okay. Sorry, not mini golf, small golf. Oops, I 
kill you. Wait, wait, <laughs> wait, no way. I meant to do that. <laughs> wait. New objective acquired. Small golf begins. Cheating? It's not cheating. Getting the ball into the hole. That's how you play small golf. See? It's literally this easy. And then it goes in the hole, which is there. <laughs> See? Look how happy Zayn is! I'm just saying, all of you fucking dorks are like, oh, but that's cheating, you're cheating the game, and it's like... Man, if they didn't want me to do it, it wouldn't be in the fucking game. What, do you think building a car in The Legend of Zelda is cheating too? Go home. Yippee! I'm fucking awesome. Sorry, I'm flipping also. I should I should watch my language a little bit. This dude's this dude's awesome. I can't shoot him. Come on, let me. Well, we basically won at small golf. I got the achievement for it. Once this is all over, I'm gonna be a pro. Is what that said. Maybe I am. You stupid idiot. <laughs> you freaking nerd. Come on. You really thought, huh? What else is in here? Time to throw balls into a hole. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Game's good. get me anything. That's not the point. We're all here to enjoy the contemplative, meditative zen uh, of getting some balls in a hole. If you know what I mean. For sheer thrill of the hunt. For sheer love of the game. Dare I say it? This is the most relaxing video games I've ever been. All these years, it's all been leading up to this. I can... Nah, it doesn't let you go through walls. 
All right. Ammo. Cool. Pretty cool. I can remember what my setup was. Thoughts on the Pegasus in Lancer? I don't remember any Lancer mechs by name, uh, but the mechs in Lancer are pretty fucking cool. Uh, the only one I remember by name is the Lancaster. Because I wanted to build a Lanny uh, when I thought about, oh shit, what if I am able to play Lancer a while ago? Thanks for the tip. minutes of this, and then I gotta go on break. The guy who makes Kill Six Billion Demons did the art for Lancer? Yeah, I know. I read it, I seen it. <laughs> it's like, very distinctly, a lot of it is very distinctly his style, so... I think he also, like, helped write it. I know multiple people worked on writing Lancer, but I'm pretty sure he was also one of them, not just the artist. Really fucking cool art, though. Here we go. That's three. It's, it's literally this easy. You, you, you just throw the ball into the hole and you just win. It's, it's literally so simple. So how y'all doing today? Do I enjoy these kinds of skill games on arcades? I've literally never been to an arcade that had a thing like this. I've only ever seen them in like cartoons and games and stuff. Ar arcades with this sort of thing in it feel like a very United States thing to me. Or maybe they just exist in places that aren't Quebec in Canada. Literally, the most I've ever seen of an arcade in person was, like, a single fucking South Park pinball machine when I was, like, eight or nine at, like, a beach. And then, like, um, my folks won a trip to, like, stay at a hotel. Um, when I was a teenager, and so we stayed like a weekend there, it was really nice. And they had an arcade room that was literally just a WWE pinball game and a foosball table. And like, to be fair, it was a fun fucking pinball table, and foosball is fun. But that is all that it was. Come down so we can get drunk at a Dave and Buster's? Literally, Adrian, literally I would love to. But I heard dragons invaded it, so... Who was on the WWE pinball? You- I barely remember what I did a couple months ago, let alone several years ago. I could not tell you who was on that pinball machine. It's only improved since the dragons? Maybe for a certain clientele. That's crass, I'm sorry. I am implying the dragons are going to have sex with you. Hey, there we are. Alright. Ski baller achievement. <laughs> I didn't even know that would give me an achievement. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. <laughs> All right, I do got to go on break. 
<laughs> it is break time. We, we, we're out here balling. But now I gotta be out here taking care of my ball joints. I don't think they're called ball joints on people. That's like what, like, dolls and action figures and stuff have. But I couldn't think of another segue involving balls and getting up to stretch. So I'm gonna go do that. Uh, <laughs> Damn, I set myself up for something else there, huh? <laughs> you make of that what you will. I'm gonna go get a drink. I'll be right back. <laughs> Hello. Uh, I was getting a little warm in my room, so I put on my, uh, my little air conditioner. I apologize if there's a little bit of background noise, but I don't apologize for cooling down. <laughs> what are we drinking? Water. <laughs> I got I got water. Also got myself a little bowl of ice cream. There's vanilla. Here's good. No, I'm not drinking someone's fucking goiter. What are you talking about? What? Will I be vanilla for Splatfest? I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to play during the Splatfest. Uh, but if I do, I'm probably going for mint chip. I don't understand why all you guys are obsessed with drinking goiters. That's gross. You're gonna get sick. I'm 
drinking normal stuff. Drinking goiter sounds foul? You understand my trepidation when I see everyone on the internet talking about it like it's the cute new trend. It's gross. Good for you, Holly, but not all of us have air conditioning. Some of us are suffering 30 se- Man, nah, get the fuck out of here with that. If you're gonna be like that, you don't get to talk. Like, if if that's happening to you, I'm sorry, but you don't, you don't get to come in here and be like, Well, you're suffering? I'm suffering a different way. And it's like... Go to bed. Drink a glass of water. Calm down. Eat my ice cream. You would straight up not survive uh, hack blood. It would consume you, and you would poo all over the floor, like big old turds. What's the matter? What does hack blood taste like? <laughs> so <laughs> sounds like someone's never used hack blood. Sounds like someone doesn't have the hack blood powers. <laughs> Keep up your training and maybe you'll understand. And it's green? I just noticed the icon for this game in, like, my system tray is that photo of Zane as a kid. That's great. Change everywhere. The Kid Cage! Five bucks per hour for kids six and under. What does that say? Colorama Squishers. Cute little drawn. Owie! Hey! I'll tell your mom that I blew you up when I get with her tonight. I thought we were just chilling, hanging out. Watching a movie. Vibing. Until then, your life will not know a moment of peace. Man, some people, huh? Some freaking people. <laughs> Got him. Give me the goods. What's in the fridge? What? Open up! <laughs> what's, what's, what's this shy little fridge? <laughs> Why don't you want to open? What's wrong, buddy? It's okay. It's okay. There's nothing even in there. Fuck off! <laughs> Those psychos really scare me. Kick him in the nard, Zane. Please? Oh, yeah. Yo, Sloppos is there. So where are we going? Um, across the street. There's more here. Let's keep looking just in case.
Yeah, buddy! Awesome. Thank you, Beetle Buddy, for the 32 months. Much appreciated. Whoa! I've got a secret! Go. Hotel rooms and bar around that. Oh, this is just where I was before. Okay, I see. You know, I never checked out the hotel rooms and bar. Bro? Bro? Another bong. I can't blow you up. You mother flipper. You having fun there? Keep it up, I think. I don't remember, have we seen a, a door? That needs a key yet in this level? You can tell me if we have, I don't remember. Oh yeah, in the manager's room, that's right! Fucking Mevin was talking about it. Let's go back there, let's go back there. Thank you, I would've forgotten otherwise. I think we saw all the laser tag stuff. This was a fun little room. I saw an interact key somewhere, but I don't remember where. Actually, oh. I'm a mouse, but you're cool, man. <laughs> it was just one of the rats. Oh man, there's a lot more. Oh, we probably need this for progress. We probably had to go back to his office anyways. Into the pit. Yes, Blade has a hack blood charge. Video games are quite cool. Uh, thank you to Robot Blues and Gracious Victory for the resells. Much appreciated. You've known this game for five minutes and you're already fascinated by whatever the hell's going on? Oh, it's awesome. It's fucking great is what's going on. Now, how do I get up there? There's windows up there. Oh, I see. Jumping puzzle. Well, I solved it. Yummy, yummy. Goodies for me. Anything over here? A little C? I love getting to see those. That's fun. Now you might look at this and think, this game looks extremely 14-year-old cool. Well, that's because it's made by a 14-year-old. It was. And then it was finished. Uh, when he and his friend were nice. Alright, down we go. The spiral staircase. All of his fucking green shirts for the damn store. Your mom's dumb. That's harsh. Dude, that's cruel, but the Psycho Syndicate does deserve it, so maybe I'll give it a pass. After what they did. This gun is also a chainsaw. Don't shoot it near other psychos or they will die. <laughs> Alright, okay.
I need a key to open this door. Okay, I need some kind of pink or purple key. Restrooms? It's like she creeps in a barrel. I'm in the barrel! It's a chainsaw because it's chain gun. Hey! <laughs> it's literally good every time. Can I get in there? Or those. Yeah, I can get in there from there. Wait, wait! Oh, never mind. From far away, this looked like a fucking Gary's mod ass misconception. I'm incredible! Okay, so that's what we need the key for to get in there. Sweet. Don't tell anyone to fail again, okay? That's just between you and me, the one person watching the stream right now. Pull back up, pull back up. Now how do we get in there? I wanna go in there. Another way I also didn't check out the toilets, I'm just realizing, hang on. Well, what if this toilet's also a trick? Surely Zane wouldn't do it more than once, right? Take that, you mother flippin' turd pile! Blade has a hack blood charge. Good news about that, Blade. This is the worst smell I've ever smelled. And I smell Mevin's butthole. Why'd you smell that, dude? Why'd you smell that, dude? Drinks, drinks. At Slayer Restroom. <laughs> Now this one's definitely a trick, but what if it wasn't? No, it's a trick. No, it's a trick. <laughs> no, it's a trick. <laughs> the S-Blade has a hack blood charge! <laughs> no, it's a trick. Zane restroom! Now come 
comes a noble warrior's just reward. Take thine wicked thought, say, for the glory of the psycho syndicate. Poop in me, Zane. Thou art worthy. Poop in me and embrace the psycho inside. I will never embrace the psycho inside. Go to toilet. Flush Zane. I will never fall for your diabolical tricks. I simply will not let it happen. Oh, we had to go here anyways for the disc, I see. <laughs> Wait, but then this just goes back around this way. So that wasn't progress. You were lame. Okay. It was, it was cool though. See what the toilet's up to. Alright, now is this open? Yeah! Now we're talking. <laughs> this is where they built them. This is where they built them. This is where guys are born. <laughs> what a weird little underground zone. That's awesome. Alright, here's the exit. Oh wait, no, we totally did need the key for this. Okay. So it was mandatory to go shit. Time. I could have just gone this way. This whole time, I could have just navigated through the hedge maze. That's cute. That's cute. Well, the door is locked from the other side. Ah, just lets you go back. Okay, in case you want to look for more secrets. Which, uh,. We only found one, huh? But we killed 300 enemies out of 183, so. I am the X Slayer. <laughs> I'm gonna have to at some point see if I can find like hints about where um, the secrets are, so I can find them on my own time. Look up the answers, I guess, but it's fun to have hints. <laughs> Cult die sack! My god, I'm having a bit more ice cream because it's good. Mm. You can tell me about one extremely good one in the level in the future if I want. Uh, sure, but I would have to be able to look, look at chat when it happens is the problem, and I don't know when it's going to be, so... No going back! Bye, I smell Goodbye, barbecue! Boy. Time to grill up some psychos! Alright! Your mom that's, is dumb! That's a bit messed up, man, but I appreciate the spirit. If you 
shoot them with their own clown bombs. They do kind of die really quick. That's the tech. Damn, they really are just out here, Grill. Who's freaking Chera? I love the, like... I love that the Kako demon equivalent is, like, clown brain. I don't know why that's so funny to me, but it's delightful. There's a foot in that damn burger. Dude, that's gross. Come on. <laughs> Let's grill a cheese. Let's hot a dog. Alright, now we're cooking. Now we're cooking. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, yeah! Yeah. Oh, yeah! <laughs> yeah! Ooh, yeah! Oh, baby! Time to move on. Just kidding, you freaking idiot. It's time to grill more. If you grill the cheese midstream, that's fucking awesome. I almost misread actually as accidentally, and I was sitting here thinking, like, how do you accidentally grill cheese? Anyways, that's awesome. Ooh? They're having fun. They live here. They're having fun. It's their house. Kill you. <laughs> Just kidding. I meant to do that. Idiot. I love the hesitation in that <laughs> voice line. <laughs> Wait, no, that shirt was so cool. Why did I blow it up? That skeleton was awesome and had a gun. <laughs> I can't believe. Thursday I'm doing my house dot wad and today I'm doing fucking their house dot PK3 or whatever. Wait, hang on. Oh, there totally is a fence in here, I just realized. <laughs> Please! Stop calling me Epic Divorce Bed! I'm sick of it! Real farts? Ride ideas for dead? Journey into butthole? What if it was a butt and you went in it? <laughs> this is totally Zane's dad, isn't it? This is totally Zane's dad, isn't it? reason he only talks about his mom and talks so highly of his mom. Wait, that's... <laughs> what the fuck? That's me! Not anymore, it's not. <laughs> Stupid idiot! I'm awesome. You can look at yourself through the mirror floor! <laughs> Scream. All right, forecast. They're calling for gun on Tuesday. That's today. Dude, the weather's looking great. Can't wait. Ah, big pie in the States. This is where my boss never goes. Flipping rich people. Yeah, can't stand him either. Map piece. Yo, nice. There's the exit. Got the 
the box. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. What are these rulers doing here? You must be this tall to get shot by a gun. Tickets to- Oh, it's for like a carnival ride or something. Watch your head, BWL. <laughs> <laughs> Pumpkin. Yo, they got racing 3000? I don't have time for games. They got turd blast out? X Slayers don't play around. X Slayers don't play around. I don't have time for games. X Slayers don't play around. Man, what a shame. This game's a classic. All the balls went into a hole. What if every ball went to a hole? Well, we basically win. So we basically won this game. That's the scare most scared looking oven I've ever seen. Oven? Fireplace, whatever. Take it could that, be both of it. New mascot? Maybe a potato theme? Definitely <laughs> potato themed. Potatoes suck, never mind! <laughs> Getting a lot of Doom Quake and Duke Nukem vibes. I mean, yeah, it's very, very directly inspired by games like that. Uh, I've never played Duke 3D myself, but I've heard some people compare it very, very much to Duke 3D in a lot of ways, which is interesting. Potato Fest itinerary to many old busted rides. Budget $100. Ride materials cardboard. Ask my son for ideas. He's a genius. Maybe this is Mevin's parents' house and not Zane's. It's like front door of a fucking <laughs> porta potty. Extremely Duke 3D. The weird self insert fanfic stuff is very in keeping with Duke 3D mods. Neat. I don't know terribly much about, uh, like, Duke 3D and the scene surrounding it. So that's neat context. What's that? Wet fucking sound. Oh, it's the damn toilet I blew up. Nice. Where's the door again? Where's the damn door? Oh, it's over here. Right. Uh-oh. Scary mode is in effect. Owie! Owie? Jay Tholen didn't know much about the Duke 3D scene? <laughs> That's awesome. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Hey, hey, where'd you go? We can't go in the toilet zone. You can't go in the toilet. There's a game called Redneck Ram- Oh shit! Do we have people in the chat room that have never heard of Redneck Rampage? This is awesome. This is- <laughs> This is a wonderful moment for you. You get to learn about Redneck Rampage! <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Redneck Rampage is a 1997 first-person shooter developed by Zatrix Entertainment and published by Interplay. A first-person shooter with a variety of weapons and levels and has a hillbilly theme, <laughs> primarily taking place in a fictional Arkansas town. Many of the weapons and power-ups border on nonsensical, and in some ways the game is a parody of both first-person shooters and rural American life. It features music by Psycho Billy and cowpunk artists such as the Beat Farmers and Mojo Neon. <laughs> In 
the United States, Redneck Rampage debuted at number 7 on PC Data's computer game sales chart for May 1997. It claimed 13th place the following month before falling to position 17 and 20 in July and August, respectively. Reviews for the title <laughs> were mixed. <laughs> Dembo, really good name by the way, writing for CNET Game Center, gave the game <laughs> three stars <laughs> and said it deserved, quote, big points for its Psycho Billy soundtrack, big points for being genuinely funny at times, and offered, quote, good fun using a crowbar to beat aliens, old coots, and Billy Rays to death. Next Generation reviewed the PC version of the game, rating it 3 stars out of 5, and stated that, quote, as creative as much as the game is, its gameplay is same old, same old. It's fun, but when it's over, you're more likely to remember the yee-haws and health replenishing whiskey bottles, instead of any of the challenger gameplay. <laughs> She's an author, you know her? Hey, hell yeah. Yeah, it's, uh... I don't think a lot of people really think of it terribly favorably. It's it's neat that it exists, I guess. I think it's a, I think it's an interesting curiosity <laughs> at at you know, some level. Can we go to this person's place? Yeah. Uh, I've never really played it myself. Shove that in your turret hole and smoke it. That's mostly because I don't think I would want to play it myself. In that sick game. The music does sound like it's good, though. Uh, thank you, Draco Bold, for the 28 months. Much appreciated. It has a source port now. That's awesome. I genuinely, genuinely. I don't even care if the games are good or not. I'm glad that so many old games are getting, like, source ports nowadays. Like, you've, you've got good shit, like Star Wars Dark Forces getting ports like that. And then you've got stuff like Red Nagger Rampage. That's... I don't know. That I, I think that's good for the sake of, like, preservation. Even if something's not great, people can still look at it and try it out. That's good. Lil Disease Cakes. Peanut cutter snacks again. Ultra diarrhea! <laughs> you won't win! Just a bowl of nards! <laughs> it runs on the same engine as Duke 3D? Oh man, that's great. Even if a game's bad, someone out there loves it so it's worth saving. Even if no one loves it. Even if no one in the world thinks this is a good video game. I, I still think preservation is valuable. It it could be the biggest piece of shit game ever. Like it could suck complete nards forever. Whoa! Feel the power of the X layers. Um. But like, hang on. Why is there a people here? Be people. I splattered something. Like, the, the world would be a lesser place if people could not play big rigs over the road racing. You know? Ah. I see you were peeping at the tub. Well, you are dead and exploded now. Sexy both on and offline. Toilet. Oh yeah, Duke 3D is build engine. I always think that it had its, like, own proprietary engine for some reason. The clothes are dead. Sorry, rich people. LOL. Oh, man. I've had a hankering lately to look into the Marathon games. I see people in chat talking about Marathon. Um, it's something I've always had, like, you, mother flipper. kind of an interest in. And then when Bungie announced the new one, and it was like, oh, that's a genre that I probably am not super interested in, uh, I was like, what if I check out the older ones at some point, though? And I have a bunch of friends recently that have been getting way into it, which is cool. <laughs> the guy in, like, the 
this guy here that I'm pointing my crosshair at looks like he's in a fucking Joker band. <laughs> this dude is in a Joker prog rock band. Gianni had extremely good streams playing Marathon? Hey, hell yeah. Hey, if you're reading this, I'm dead. I think my parents were replaced with psychos and think they know I know. Oh no, here they come. I. Dude, environmental storytelling is awesome. Whoa! I found a secret! Whoa! Maybe I'm a little stinky, but that's just how I wanna be! Dude, Bethesda fucking wishes they could do it like Zane. Like, straight up. They got nothing on him. They got nothing on him. They got nothing on him. <sighs> all, all that stuff they're doing, Elder Scrolls 6, Fallout, whatever, 76, uh, Starfield. You take all that, you put all that in the fucking trash bin. You put that in the toilet. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge. None of them have an S-Blade. None of them are even getting the hack blood charge. The S blade has a hack blood charge. Like... Come on. Now where do you go? Now where do you go? I can't open you. You don't go anywhere. spend an entire 10-15 minute segue uh, shit-talking Starfield, a game that isn't even out yet that I know I'm probably gonna be a sour on when it releases. Uh, but I want to talk about this cool thing instead that I'm playing right now, so I'm gonna do that. Sloppos. This game's cool, isn't it? <laughs> All right, where else can we go? Not this way. The psychos are in the houses, dummy! The ultimate Doom has a Eula now, but Doom 2 doesn't. Why? No one's coming to help, BWL! Cool truck, cool truck. Oh wait, it's that sicko's truck. He's too strong, we gotta go. You smell like turds! Awesome house, awesome house. It's probably just the generalized Bethesda Eula. I mean, probably, but also, like, why just that one and not Doom 2 as well? Is what has me curious. Even if it is just gonna be, like, the standard boilerplate Eula. Why only one of them? <laughs> Wait! Hang on. Die. They're playing Trennis. Dude, they got a fucking Trennis court. Whoa, sport. Hold on there. Now, what are you doing snooping around in my neighborhood? Trying to steal one of my cars? I'm surprised you survive with all the psychos out there. I'm surprised you survive, since you're so weak and you smoke sticky green all day. <laughs> My mom should have dumped you when she was still alive. By the way, I found your secret psycho base under your office. Whoa there, hold up bro. What are you talking about? 
You're the one taking drugs if you think I'm a psycho syndicate gang boss. Don't you think people would have noticed? Hmm. He has a point. Plus, Mebody's too weak and stupid to build a whole secret base. And he lives with his mom and dad like a little baby. Anyway, I have to go. And Zane, stay away from my house if you know what's good for you. jokes about fucking his mom. I just thought he meant it in like a dude I had sex with your mom kind of way. Not no. <laughs> Saint's mom was dating this dude kind of way. Fuck. <laughs> dude, this game is a fucking roller coaster. It's great. Wait, they're they're playing tennis. They're having fun. Who am I to stop them? The wrong X -layer. I'm an X player, so I am. The S blade has a hack blood charge. The S blade has a hack blood charge. Got him. It's so cool that my friend is here. Ooh, hang on, yeah, I'm getting some drop frames right now. That looks like it's okay now. I I guess also the wiggling around didn't help with the bitrate terribly much, but... I'm gonna smack some balls, and then I'm gonna score! <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Dude, happy pride! <laughs> happy pride! Love wins. How do I smack some balls? I can't. I can't get the racket. Damn. The balls push you and bounce off at you. Oh my god. <laughs> But you don't mind. Yes, 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 yes. Load that sucker up. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Love the game using broken glasses, Anna. Yeah, it's a really cute um. Call it a novelty necessarily. I feel like that's not quite the right word, but like I don't know. It's 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 a cute little mechanic that you can do. Just yeah, it shoots shards of broken glass, so you can break any windows and just pick that stuff up. It's novel. So I guess novelty works in that regard. The like, I love the texture used for the top of the grill because it straight up looks like a mortar and pestle. <sighs> It's 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 using just like the fucking stone texture or whatever. It's great. This one, there we go. Pretty stupid. What the? Whoa! I found a secret. Now what's in there? You going up? Hey, is there a way in there? People in chat, do you know? Is there a way in there? Can I get in that door specifically? I feel like probably no, but... Okay, no, this is, uh... This is his house, okay. So I wonder if the other house really was just, like, riffing on uh, Zane's dad then. Ring, ring. Beep. Welcome to the X-Slayer hotline. Leave a message. But if you're a psycho, shove a turd up your bunghole. Haha, <laughs> I missed the jump again. <sighs> Nice, 
Yes. Oh, oh, oh. What's up here? What's up here? Anything? Goodies for Holly? Treats for Holly? No. Damn. Oh, that would have been perfect, though. Hang on. Who's this room? <laughs> now hang on a tick. Now wait just a moment. Phase two. Mevin's awesome shrine to himself. His awesome skull computers. His, his secret diary. <gasps> Look at you! You're a friend, though. You, you're a buddy. The number one dollar store. These three rings. These, these mysterious rings. Three, I see. I like you. I like you. Why can't I steal you and take you with me? Wait, 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 wait. Now this changes everything. Now this, can I get you out the door? Now this changes everything. I'm awesome. Now, now this changes everything. Hey, bro. Brainwashing machine over the bed? I mean, I guess. Some kind of scary machine for his mom and dad, I guess. Hey. You're my best friend now, okay? And we're gonna go there? Come with me? We're going on an adventure? Stay safe, okay? I'm incredible! Owie! You good, buddy? That's good. Okay. Wait, was that thing on the screen a gift from Hypnospace? I didn't really like parse what it was. That's cute, if so. Alright, buddy. This is your room now. Okay? Keep it safe. Keep it secret. Whoa! I found a secret! The Royal Deuce! Awesome. You've never found this? What do you mean? The cracked wall was right there. The wall had cracks on it. That's where bombs go. You've won 100% of this game and never found this? This isn't even a secret? It played the secret! Sound? It said, whoa, I found a secret when I did. That's totally a secret. Having to hit it multiple times that got you- It vibrated! It jiggled! It jiggled and wiggled! P.S. I made out with your mom last night. That's awesome. Oh, I see where we are. I, like, mapped it out in my head. Alright, get him, boys! Mevin's brainstorming board. Invention. A really hot girl psycho. Blonde hair. Looks like Zane's mom. Test out in the Fun Zone Hotel. 
problems. One, her talking sounds too insane and makes it hard to get it on because it's distracting. Two, if the batteries run out, your thingy can get stuck in there. Ow. Jesus, dude. <laughs> this is how Bioshock and New Silent Hill enemies are developed. A little, huh? <laughs> Do you think Mevin is a real guy in the Hypnospace universe? Oh, fucking absolutely. Like, this, this, the whole trend of, like, um, making a game to fucking riff on people I know in real life that I hate was, like, very much a thing. Dude, you're into fucking fridge, lol. All the damn bongs here. What? What did that do? Two more to go. Maybe you should give up and go to bed, BWL. I don't have time for games. Oh, you- you have me intrigued now. You- Oh, wait! Okay, that's totally a switch. I thought it was just a... Hmm. That's on. That's on. Okay, we look for more. Anything in here? I don't need to do laundry. My mom does that. Uh, oh. Ha ha ha! Got anything in here? <laughs> the race car bed. You sleep in a big, beautiful race car bed with your wife. Oh. Ha. Cute. Ah. I see. Ever slept in like a race car bed? I can't imagine those things are fucking comfy. I would not want to sleep in one with my wife or alone. That was a hint? What was a hint? What was what was hinting? Did I miss something? Oh, I see what you mean. Okay, that's cute. <laughs> I got jump scared by this room. <laughs> well, they blew up their own damn hole, so I'll take it. Ooh, hang on. I'm gonna hit the snooze button because I don't want to go on break just yet. Hey, man. Oh, I should probably be using guns that aren't just the machine or the shotgun, but man, the shotgun feels good. <laughs> Today's experiment: blow up Zane. Also, Steph is here. Uh oh. Ouch. There we go. Jared? My messed up Jared room. Dude, you love my Jared room. I think more evil guys should make us Jared room. Dog. <laughs> it says hell! Hated by dogs worldwide. Um, 
What happened to the dog? Smile. That crater's normal, isn't it? Steven? Is there a TV for Steven? Ah, they drop him in the vat. Guys. I don't think Steven's of this universe anymore. Hey, if you like my, my joke, consider paying me a million dollars for it. For more jokes about Steven Universe topical funny humor. Steven. And nothing else. Where was the stairs? I want to go back down the stairs. There. Nina. What was Nina? Uh, shooting her with a bullet. Okay. Well, here's a vent. Come on, go there. Yeah. Scary. What are these scary drawings we keep seeing? Not scary, as in, like, well, you know what I mean. I feel like it's the kind of thing someone's gonna see and misinterpret as, like, a creepypasta or something. Yo, the rocket launcher! Uh, this is the eat a burger and you die room. <laughs> well, I didn't die, so. Hmm. Maybe it's fine. Let's go back to whose room was it that had the vent? It wasn't Fido. It was not Steven, it was this one, right at the start. <laughs> Sad face! No! What did they do? And who did they do it to? <laughs> Idiot! <laughs> Vivian. The S Blade has a half blood charge! The S Blade has a half blood charge! Awesome. Baseball bat. Just hit him with a baseball bat. It's that easy. Help me! <laughs> Tex. Well, they blew him up with the bat. These Psycho Syndicate goons are really scary. They have wolf DNA, and they are injecting me with it. This character's line reads, they're so goddamn funny. <laughs> All right, I'm going to get up. I'm going to have my stretch. I'm going to get some more water. Maybe do the same for yourself because it's just going to be ads for a couple of minutes. We'll be back real soon.
Okay, I'm back. Hi. Got a water. Now I can drink it. I really like the anecdote someone posted in chat. Um, that fucking, uh... <laughs> Tosh recorded her lines on a phone in a car. That's really goddamn good. Time to go to class! Owie! That's scary. Why is that there? Crayons. One, two, kill. One, two, three, four, murder, five, six, seven, eight, kill. One. Pretty bad. Pretty bad. Beep. What else we got here? Oh? Oh? Where do you go? Oh, just over here again. I see. I see. You don't go anywhere. You're just for fun. Hole. Fun hole. Goodbye. I love you. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. But don't fret anyone. The S Blade does have a hack blood charge, so maybe it's not all bad. Maybe it's fine. See? Do we have more ammo here? Yes. Gonna burn. Maybe it's fine. I hate when girls die. Rip, my friend and fellow X Slayer. We probably would have gone out if you weren't turned into a werewolf. <laughs> yep, just as I expected. 30 people in chat chiming in to call him a coward. <laughs> Alright, where the hell do we go now? Where do we go now? Hmm. Up the stairs. The saw is having so much fun. Uh, I guess we can find the stairs and go back down. Free ammo, though. I'll take that. Ah! Fido. That's a guy. Did they just make a guy eat dog food?
me in, okay? Mevin's sick and twisted like that? I guess he is. Given how he's like the Psycho Syndicate boss. Okay. Oh, we're in the purple. Your grandma's a toilet, dummy. We gotta use the rocket launcher. It's what she would have I've literally already forgotten her name. It's what she would have wanted, right? It was literally her favorite weapon before she became a cool wolf or whatever. Ow. Don't touch them, they're hurting. I tested it out for you, okay? Shot, make it count. Whoa, I found a secret. It was a mirror. I see. I got tricked. Hello? Just kidding. The psychos messed up you the phone lines. Are awesome. You're awesome, Zane. You ever need cheese? You know who to call. I do need cheese. They really messed with the wrong hacker this time. <laughs> I'm glad my buddies are here. Oh, another vent, huh? It won't budge. Another vent, huh? Sure, don't mind if I do. <sighs> How many secrets have I found? Five out of six, not bad. 180 out of 417. Huh. <laughs> what have I missed? Ah! The S Blade has a hack look. I now see what I have missed. Welcome to the Joker room. You come here to get silly? Came here to get something else, motherfucker. Well, there's the exit. But I want to go in this burger. It won't budge. Cool skulls up there, though. Hmm. Secret of the legendary burger. It won't budge. What that? This one? I can't open it. Damn. Well, this is just the exit, right? But not even that'll open. Hmm. Hmm. What's the puzzle here? Vent we fell in through. Time. skulls. This is probably something very obvious that I'm gonna feel a little silly about, but I'm having fun. Hey. If you were that ugly, I do not want to see your mama. It was just one guy. It was just one guy. <laughs> Awesome. It won't budge. One little guy I could not see. That's funny. That one still doesn't open, though. Hmm. This, though. This is open now. I get burgers? Um. Ouch. 
Was I supposed to stay in there? The S blade has a maximum charge. Well, I'm here now. What is he? The corpse was getting in my damn way. Owie. Ooh, I'm hurting a little. Nah, I'm not doing insane. I'm doing the, uh, I'm awesome. <laughs> I probably could have done insane. Oh well. That'll be fun for a replay. Got the clone bomb. sounds the rocket launcher dudes. I can't tell if they're also meant to be like wolves or not. Oh, they totally are, because they also go, I love you. Still only 200 out of 400 enemies. Where are the it others? Much. What in the hell did I miss? That's wild. I can't open it. Zane, beloved of furries? Yeah, Zane's like me. Um, where furries find themselves inexplicably drawn to him. Anyways, in we go. <laughs> it's all the chains everywhere. That's awesome. Are we going into the computer world? Dude! I am the X-Slayer. Let's go. Zane. Mikey? Is that you? Yes. There's no time to waste. The Psycho Syndicate has hidden the Hackblood Talisman, the most powerful Hackblood weapon in the world, inside this computer. Get it, and we can finally revenge Stephanie's death and make the Psychos pay. Revenge? The S-Blade has a Hackblood charge. <laughs> <laughs> we can revenge it. <laughs> we can revenge it. Yeah, this game fucking rules. Can't go in there neither. You just messed with the wrong exit. How are we gonna go forward if the bridge is out? <laughs> Like this, I guess.
Oh, I'm going to... No, I'm okay. This place... It looks just like a level from my favorite game, Cataclysm. What? Yes, I coded it just for you. I knew you would know what to do. Now go! <laughs> it's okay that we're just taking an entire level from Cataclysm because it's part of the story. It's fine. Was Cataclysm mentioned in Hypnospace? I don't remember. Oh, we only have the Hackblood here. We we only have we only have the S blade. I just realized. Oh, and we're regenerating Hackblood here too. Oh, down we go. Oh, we're here now. Okay. Well, I guess I'm here now. All right. So now I'm here. Now. Is that good? It's burgers in here. There's like no enemies or anything. This is fun. Psycho CPU. Pack blood talisman or memory banks. There's burgers here. Don't get tricked. Jezta Dimension Gate 5. Oh, well, I hurt someone. <laughs> Can I reload this level? Yeah, the S Blade has a hack blood charge. Let's go back from the start. This place. It looks just like a level from my favorite game, Cataclysm. Oh, this straight up is. Yes, I coded it just for you. Okay, I, I knew you would know what to do. Now go. Map piece. The eating sounds are really funny. And that takes us here, which is where we were. Hey, I see it up there! We need it! We need to go get it! Gun up there. Okay, can I see? Can I see? Warning: fan blades are dangerous. This is the Hackblood Talisman. Shoot once for a projectile blast, or hold down and charge your energy for a powerful beam. Inside this computer, your Hackblood will recharge by itself. Let's show the Psycho Syndicate what a real Hackblood Master is like. The spitting trees drop hack blood when shot. Use them wisely to keep flying. Oh, okay. That the S blade has a hack blood charge. The S blade has a hack blood charge. You're just lucky you're catching my yards. Oh my god. Let's try 
Only he then in my has a hack blood charge. Let's do it again, but what if we did it better? It up. I just realized this is Jester dimension, like Jester, like the funny little guys. Not be standing still against these guys. I keep doing this. The S blade has a hack blood charge. Hey, thanks for the raid. The S blade has a hack blood charge. There we go. Okay, three blasts to take out the rocket launchers. The S blade has a hack blood charge. The S blade has a hack blood charge. S-Blade has a hack blood charge. I like the way it just fizzles, like, right completely into the weaker enemies sometimes. What if I just get you? What if I just get you? What if it's me when I fucking get you? Hover over there and get that. Whoa! Hi. I found a secret. <laughs> Hi. Ow. Fuck. <laughs> That's fun. That's fun. <laughs> hey, thanks for the 25 month resub as well. And the rate. I appreciate it. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. There was a blow up of a wall back here, so I'm gonna go back and blow up it. Cause, uh, that's a secret. I love secret. The S Blade has a hack blood. Whoa! I found a secret! Ah, we're getting all our weapons back here. I see, I see. That's fun, that's fun. Uh, two out of eight. <laughs> And a burger. Didn't you love getting a half-blood charge? The music here is a lot of fun. Which level is this? Uh, hang on. What does it say if I just do like this? Um, five. I, th I think it's five? I haven't really been counting them. I just remember that like... Didn't he say he put a song for his uncle in like level seven or something? Next time and I'll kick you in the nards. <laughs> I'm waiting for when we get to hear that. I think that'll be fun. Was this by one of the Hypnospace Outlaw devs? So this is a sequel. <laughs> this is. Do you remember Zane Rocks fourteen? This is a video game that he made. In universe. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Alright, now let's go here. You literally don't remember Zane? That's surprising, because he's one of the most memorable characters in that entire video game. The 
Yes, Blade has a hack what? charge. I I got such a bad fucking memory, and I remember Zane. The yes, S-Blade has a half blood charge! You didn't okay the game? That's okay, someone else did, that's why I got blubbed. The yes, S-Blade has a half blood charge! Mind you, what the S Blade has? It's hard to say. No one's really sure. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. We have our top lines looking at the S Blade right now. has a hack blood charge. The S Blade awesome has a hack blood charge. What is this cool maze I've seen? Whoa! I found a secret. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. The Psycho Syndicate are the good guys of Earth. The X Slayers are the evil ones. X Slayers are stealing has a your hack blood, blood power. We must stop them together. What? A little lame, baby. Uh oh. Are we the bad guys? The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Are we the bad guys? The yes, S-Blade has a hack blood charge. Is what we're doing okay? The yes, S-Blade has a hack blood charge. I'm gonna fall, I'm gonna fall. It's sinking. The yes, S-Blade has a hack blood charge. Oh no, I'm extremely gonna fall. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Good news about the S Blade, though, everyone. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Oh my god, there's like actual Kako Demons now. We get actual Jester Kako Demons now, not just the little. The S Blade guys. has a hack blood charge. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Take that, you mother flipping turd pile! deny that these enemies sound like if the Joker could beatbox? What? The S Blade has a hack blood charge. I can't work on this game. I can't confirm or deny anything. Who's playing? Pretty good sound. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Where are we? We don't have a map for this bit. And because I fell down, I got teleported somewhere else. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. The S Blade ah, has a hack here. blood charge. So it does just go back here. Nice, nice. Big roundabout. 
magical Joker spine. Magical Joker spine could beatbox. Oh, I ran out of hack blood. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot to keep track of. Wait, now where the hell is it put me? Oh, no, it is still this place. Now I'm not regenerating any, though. Huh. The x layers are your enemy. The x layers are concealing your green energy to use for themselves. Jez does the Psycho Syndicate are your friends. I don't think it's supposed to be doing this. Try falling in a pit again. Oh yeah, I can't imagine the bit rate is terribly happy with this area. Hey, it's still not regenerating. Huh. Interesting. Hey, is there like a, a no clip? command I can use or something so I can just get out of here. Because <laughs> it's, uh, huh. I wasn't doing this before. I was regenerating in this room earlier. It was fine earlier. Maybe I can try jumping up there? Hmm. Weird? I agree, big-breasted men. I do think it's weird. Oh well. That happens sometimes in a video game. That's programming. <laughs> if I use my blast, then I'll just use it some more. Um. This is the autosave all the way back there, though. That's a bummer. Hmm. Let's try... Saving here, and then loading here. See if that does anything. Oh yeah, that's fine now. Huh. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge. Well, good news everyone, the S-Blade has a hack blood charge. I'm glad I decided to think. Turn it off and on again. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge. Is that simple? It's really that simple. Can I, can I get up there? Can I, can I get up here? No? Please? Oh, well, at the very least, the s is about to get a half blood charge. Yeah, I know. I saw people in chat the earlier S -Blade saying. Has a hack blood charge. Yeah, I know, Zane. Don't worry. I saw people in chat earlier talk about how the section didn't um, used to have regen. Now it does. Oh, I see what you mean by jumping before beaming. You have to like do it right before it goes off. Cause like I've been jumping right as I start charging, and I just land immediately. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. So you do have to jump like right before it goes off, but also like. Oh, right, it's reloaded on the bad things. Well, out we go. Skeleton. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. I didn't hit the jump there. Maybe we just can't go up there. That's fine. That's fine. That's allowed. It's okay if you don't go up everywhere. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. It's also good if the S Blade has a hack blood charge. So who's to say? Really? 
No, pointing up doesn't affect going up or down. Huh, I was able to make that jump earlier. It seems a little finicky sometimes, in terms of like how much height you get. I think I'd always try going to it from there. That would certainly work. Like I could follow the path this way. Have a delicious drink. Do that. I'm I'm also a sucker for giant stylized computer type of level. Ah, now there's new tech. Okay, that does feel pretty good. <laughs> I'm loving the blast. I also have the other weapons I can use. Literally so happy. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. He's literally so happy. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. What a delicious burger is in there. Anything up here? Anything up here? What's up here? Anything? I guess not. Wait, wait. Burger on the roof. Burger on the roof. Burger on the roof. Burger on the roof. Really good amount of health, by the way. little hats. Okay, nothing there. Well, actually... The S-Blade has a hack blood mm -hmm. charge. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What if I slow down a little? No, that still makes me slip off. I do that. But I... There's a goodie there, it looks like. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge. Your mom's dumb. I guess that guy's there to make sure you get enough charge back. Did Zane ever provide a source for the S-Blade having a hack blood charge? What do you mean? Source, I fucking told you. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge. Ew! It smells like a diaper full of weak old rotten shrimp and baby turds in here. Ah! Whoa! I found a secret! Source, dude, just trust me. Okay, we can beam the poo poo pile. That's the goodie. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Let me up, let me up, let me. There we go. Oh, well. <laughs> I was so slick with it. Now let's check the other side. Now let's check the other side. Mm -hmm. 
No, but there's drink. There's this. from here. Hearing interesting things lately about the S-Blade? Ah, uh, I don't know. I don't think we'll ever catch on. There's a weird secret here if you want to know about it. You're gonna have to say more than a weird secret. Elaborate a little bit, but just a little bit. Get into the castle towers. You know what? Sure, hit me with it. I'm curious. You piqued my curiosity. Hey. Launching missile at me? Ow! Die! Literally go to hell. If you know how. The one on the in the front, on the edge side. What do you mean by that? On the in the front, on the edge side. Oh, I see. Oh, I stopped that jump, but I can totally make it from here, I bet. Or like from there. I'll let this recharge a little bit, so how are you guys doing? How's uh how's it going? I've heard some some things about the X the S Blade recently. I don't know if I can really verify any of it, but some things might be up with the hack blood charge. So I've heard. So I've been told. Ah. Slightly too low. Is there a door to this house? Yeah, but it's not. Mostly pretty good? Hell yeah. That's better than not good. Whoa! I found a secret! You are awesome! Thanks, man. This rat's having so much fun. Jetpack blasting around. Oh, there's totally like windows here, too. Were those always here? Those were totally always there, unless they just appeared or something. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge! Dude, that's awesome. Can I get on the other side? I would like to try for other side. Okay. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge! I missed, but... It's, uh... We can recover. The S Blade has a hack blood charge! That's cool, that's cool. Where are the rats you missed them? We literally the saw S -Blade a rat has a hack blood charge. not a minute or two ago. You weren't paying attention. You don't get a damn rat. Whoa! I found a secret! The S Blade has a hack blood charge! These are the men.
<laughs> Why are they here? That's so cute! Think I blew one of them up? Don't worry about it! Smile! Oh, this just leads to down there. Okay. Come to the toilet key. That's fun. That's fun. Oh, oops. Thank you, Ball of Disaster, for the 18 months. I have so much blood on my hands, how do I feel? <laughs> Pretty fucking good. Let's go. I gotta admit, I'm feeling pretty good. from the beginning. The oh, S blade has a hack blood charge. Ooh, we've beaten basically all the level too. All right. Wait, what's in here? What's in here? Hello? The S blade has a hack blood charge. Literally in the special world? Is this this is awesome i i feel like this was put here by mistake like in universe by mistake this is great i love when a game just has weird holes you can find that's awesome that's beautiful oh man i like I genuinely really like the way that, like, the weird seams in the skybox and, like, the top and bottom voids look. That's so cool. Dude, this game's fucking great. <laughs> you, you could literally tell me that the actual developers of this video game put that there by accident. And I would still tell you, I don't care. Game's great for this. Game's great for this. Alright, let's climb. Good climbing music. The S Blade has a hack blood charge! Ah, that's why it looks like that, because it's like you're getting out of the computer. That's fun. That's cool. What's the bottom one there, then? Cataclysm in the computer. Pretty good? Pretty good? Zane. I have helped you on your journey, but my spirit must depart. Cool, bye dude. You are the final ex-slayer. You are the only one strong enough to defeat the psychos. Now go to the Boise Potato Festival. <laughs> this is where the psychos' power is concentrated. You must stop them. Goodbye, my son. son. Wait, were his son, 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 son? Son? What did he mean by son? 
I will never know. We'll never know what he meant by this. <laughs> we have our top men looking into the matter. Cottonwood Mobile Home Park. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge! No going back. <laughs> We're still missing, uh... The chainsaw again. That's too bad. Oh. Right, we don't regenerate here anymore. Gonna have to be a little more choosy with my shots. Yes, Blade has a hack blood charge. Okay, I'll take out the damn wolf. Yes, Blade has a hack blood charge. Hey, man. Who's his son, son, son? Zane, apparently. I wonder what he meant by that. Other break area. Wait, is there a break area somewhere else here that I missed? That's funny. Ah! <laughs> I completely missed that sign. Good bit, good bit. Anything down there? Do we have a map? No. Can we go? Your grandma's a toilet, dummy! The S-Blade has a hack blood charge! Owie! The pistols are cool, you gotta use them. Wait, that's... Cooper is dead. And it is good that he is dead. I think Zane had issues with his dad? I mean, yeah, his dad wasn't, like, in his life and all. At all. And, like... There, there, there are, like, very clearly bits where, like, there is some dad, like, being pictured and mentioned and talked about. And he just has, like, actual pictures of, like, some dad and, like, a baby. It's probably him! Like... There's, there's a reason, it seems, why the dad is not in his life. And why he instead has to deal with, like, his shitty Dollar Shave boss, like, getting with his mom or whatever. Who he also does not like. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge! Hang on, they're dancing in here. Yeah. Ouch. Let me in. Yo, they got a weed bong for smoking bunts. It's. It's so fucking 15 year old in such a charming way to be like, oh, weed? Only bad and messed up dudes smoke that stuff. The goopers are here. The straight up goopers are here. Not allowed. Not allowed. Not allowed. Let's check out the map. Alright, that's where we gotta go. How many levels are in this game total? X Psycho Cheap Door Installation. Trying our best. Oh. <laughs> Help, I got st Oh no, that's so sad. Like a damn pancake. Seven? Okay. So I think we're on six right now, right? You 
just messed with the wrong X layer. Hey. Through the damn windows, dude. Yeah, the, the gumshoe gooper plush was like a real thing. <gasps> the rhino is back! I can redeem myself. It is time for the rhino roundup! I love you. I'm obsessed with you. More queef. Cool fish, though. See- wait. Wait, 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 wait. Wait a second. Note to self, get new key from Mark. I need a key to open this door. Damn it! I need a key to open this door. I wanna blow that up so fucking bad. I need a key to open this door. I wanna blow this up so bad. I want to blow this up so damn bad. All this fucking C4! I need it. I guess I'll have to come back with a key card. Who the hell is Mark? <laughs> I need a key to open this door. I want to blow this up so goddamn bad. I need to know. I need to know. I need to know. Here's what I also need to do is go and break again. Uh, I'm gonna get up for stretches then. Uh, enjoy the pulse pounding beats. I'll be back in a couple of minutes.
gaming? No, that's not. There we go. I need to get rid of that fucking scene. I keep telling myself that. Ribs are delicious? Nice. Uh, we have not beaten the game, no. We're gaming. We got all the weapons. The poops are back. You smell like turds. Not more. Cause you're dead. Alright, let's chainsaw through. Tear him up. This blade has a half blood charge. I have a feeling this section's gonna be like a bunch of arena segments. I'm okay with that. That sounds fun to me. Controls. Awesome room. Wait! That's a <laughs> That's just straight up a hypnospace headband. <laughs> Cute! You can't have that, dude. That'll give you beef brain. I guess this game was made in 98. That was before the, the mine crash. I was wondering if there was just gonna be like straight up, uh, like a headband or something somewhere. That's fun. That's fun. That's cute. Some kind of magazine. Oh my god, I never shot, thought to shoot the bread like this in a room like this. <laughs> oh, I wonder who that is. I wonder if that's a baby Zane. The Taylor Residence. Wait, residence spelled like that. <laughs> have a kid. Some of these might be in him as like an adult. Eat it, dipweed! <laughs> Thank you, Wraith Claw, for the 27 months. Much appreciated. I don't remember if I said thank you yet. Kitty! Fucking forget everything I was saying. Look at this cat. But also, thank you to Ball of Disaster for the reason. Just in case. Oh, right, I wanted to go back because I have the key card now. Zane's mom sucks, BWA. Damn! 
something is truly wrong with the Psycho Syndicate. They're, they're evil. I feel like they might be bad. I think they might be kind of bad guys. Didn't Zane die of beef brain? You didn't save him. You did not save him. When you played Hypnospace Outlaw, you didn't save him. You can save Zane. <laughs> you personally killed him. That's not nice to say. You didn't do that. <laughs> now, what over here? Okay, this is where we just went. Good, good, good. Bomb house, bomb house. I'm right? Oh, okay. I need a key to open this door. I need, I need a, a key, key to open this door. Okay. Um. Be, be. I was about to say be straight with me, but that's the wrong thing to say to my community. Be, be real with me. Have I just not reached where that key card is yet? <laughs> is it like later on in the level? Yes? Okay. Let's keep going. We have more houses to look at here. We went in that one. We didn't go in this one yet. No. It said male, not Mark, did it? Clap again. Do Sans Undertale? I'm not taking unpaid requests. You wanna you wanna sand undertale? You buy this game for yourself and you do it. I'm also not taking paid requests, but I appreciate the bits. Uh, Blue Graves, thank you for the super chat. I would really prefer. I I wish I could disable that. I get like very little money from that. Just just tip me. Just fucking tip me. It is like a 70-30 split and also Twitch takes 5%. I'm getting like 60 cents from that. Just, just hit me.
The super chat stuff does kind of suck, yeah. Can it not be disabled? Not as far as I know. If there is some way to turn it off, please tell me. I can't stand it. <laughs> I can set the minimum amount really high. Huh. like the idea of setting the minimum to a hundred either because then that means someone's gonna go oh i see i'm gonna do this thing and be really generous to the streamer and then it's like all right well like close to 50 bucks of that isn't even going to me you know There's a reason I haven't set up alerts for it, and it's because I don't like the feature. I don't like the feature. Hope you like my song. Skeleton! It's time to chew ass and chew through wires, and I'm all out of wires. The turd rings are dead. <laughs> Just notice the music is stopped. Oh, it's back up as soon as I say that. Welcome to Idaho! Are you having so much fun here in Idaho, bingo? <laughs> scary. <laughs> Truly a scary moment. Cottonwood. Noble home park. Yeah, they did they did go to eat the cereal because cereal is quite yummy. Hey man. Authorized access only, no trespassing. Trespassers will be disintegrated. Oh, what a lame baby. You guys might have trying to read this up. Um, no X-Slayers, X-Slayers will be destroyed. Okay, well, I guess I won't go. That's too bad. Well, what's over here? I need a key outside. to open this door. Ah. Psychos blew up potato field. Rat population booms. It's so cool, says boy. <laughs> Thanks, boy. It was messed up! Man witnesses su that's just a burger. That's just a burger there. Alright. I, I guess it's one of them backtrack a little bit type of secrets. Unless there's like a house here I missed with a goodie in it. But it's looking like no. I didn't mean to use the heck blood for that, but oh well. Ooh, rockets. Zane is straight edge hardcore. Uh, I mostly think that it's like. I don't know if this is a thing nowadays anymore, but certainly back in my day, like, there, there, there was absolutely a type of kid that was like, man, weed and drug is so fucking stupid. We idiots do that stuff, kind of thing. I just chalk it up to that personally. Dare brain disease? That's a good way of putting that. <laughs> Fear is fine because Homer Simpson does that. You know? 
<laughs> Dare worked on one kid, and it's a kid that wasn't even in our universe. <laughs> Can't believe this game is real. Yeah, it's fucking awesome. I am, like, so, so fucking charmed by, um, the, the Hypnospace folks just going, like, all right, so, you know, we're, we're making Dream Settler as, like, our big uh, follow-up to Hypnospace. But, like, what if we make something else in the meantime as, like, a spin-off thing? And what if it was, like, a character exploration of, like, one of our most beloved characters and also was just, like, an in-universe, like, retro shooter? It's fun. It's, it's a fun combination of things to do. Uh, does my S-Blade have a hack blood charge? No. I am at 18 hack blood. I, 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 I've been spending it. Oh, right, these blow up. Hey, hey. What if these blow up? Yeah. Keep forgetting and blow these up. Yeah. It's just goddamn. Do I enjoy other old school shooters? Oh, I've played through, like, basically all the Doom games except for Doom Eternal. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> awesome. And by played through, I mean, like, I streamed them. Uh. I do want to get around to doing more, more, uh, old shooters. They were a fun type of game to play. Fun thing to hang out for, I think. I never played Blood. Am I going to get around to Eternal? Yeah. Uh, I would like to upgrade my computer first, though. Is the main issue. Okay, so it doesn't come down and crush you. Like I thought it would. No fall damage. Okay. I forgot to tell you. I am your grandma. Owie! Grandma. Good mix between genuine love for the genre and humorously manifesting Midwest teenage id. That's a good way of describing this game. It's 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 a very fun combination of, like, goals this game is trying to achieve, um, while also being, like, very funny, uh, and, like, if, if, if you're openly looking for it, uh, at times, very poignant. I'm stuck. I am, like, actually stuck. I- Holly, you son of a bitch, you've done it again! You've- you found another tiny crevice to get stuck in. Live on stream. For everyone to see. Once again. <laughs> Wait, can I just beam out? Oh my god, yeah, I can. So how was your day? What'd you get up to today? I woke up really late today, so I didn't really do much. And I spent most of the day trying to fight off the haze of waking up late and feeling groggy. Vampire Survivors, hell yeah. That game's fun. Got hailed on? Damn. It's... They keep saying there's gonna be, like, huge fucking storms here. Um. And there was, like, nothing today except for, like, a little bit of rain. Which I'm... Ow. What? What? Is that normal? Is 
Is that good? Is that is that good? <laughs> Calling all video game players. Is that good? Wait! <laughs> he just did a god game of way lame joke! Fuck yeah! <laughs> oh, I'm gonna hack it. Damn it. I'm just trying I can just jump up here. Okay. It's back the way I came. Where's this? It won't budge. Exit. Oh, it's back here. Hey, bro. Is all Zane's old webpage stuff gone by the point this game came out? I mean, this game came out in 2023. Hypnospace fucking went under 2000. Uh, there's like the archival project. I'll tell your mom that I blew you up when I get with her tonight. It's not really, like, public in-universe. I don't think it is, at least. Oh, I just swerved into that one there, too. Oops. Yeah! Hey! You cut that out, I'm hurting me! Ah! I see. Now we go back. Now we go back. Okay. That's fun. It's all connected. Wait, wait, wait. How do I... How do I get up? Blow up trailers, call up reinforcements, flood toilets. Damn. Zane mentioned the HAP in Discord a couple times. I was not aware that having to join the Discord would be, like, mandatory for getting the whole story. Huh. Interesting. Oh, no, the exit's open. Hey, man. Oh, 3%, huh? Burger! More like Jay answers questions in universe is saying, Yeah, that's what I mean, though. That's that's what I mean by that when I say that. Do you miss anything if you don't join the Kingdom Hearts official Discord server? I gotta be real, I think if you join an official Disney Discord server, they take something from you permanently and you can never get it back. I already think public Discord server for a product or service or whatever is like one of the scariest places on the internet to go to. And the thought of it scares me a lot. One run by Disney scares me even more. Oh hey, all the places are blown up. Dude, it's the golden victory bomb. 
And now it's gone. Alright, let me in. Don't blow up the mail again! Management. Tell me what to do. On the next one. Eat it, Dipweed! He is dead now? Who's dead? Who's dead? What do you mean? Brother? Why does this fucking baby keep it? It's so funny. You're just lucky I didn't kick you in the nards. Is it like some kind of safe scum prevention thing or? Oh, am I just having a weird baby run? Some kind of scum baby? Some kind of scum baby in this game? They got a scum baby in this? Anyways, I think I literally have to blow up the mail. Like... The, the, the key's in there, I have to blow up the mail. I don't know why people are being like, no, he's not gonna survive or whatever. He killed him. I, I gotta do that to get the key. But there's nothing else in here. I don't know why people were freaking out like I was killing someone in this room. Were they talking about the bomb? Well, at least the skull bomb is okay. Well, at least the Gatorade bomb is- well... At least the cool weed poster is okay. Nothing can take that from us, right? Feel the power of the X-Layers! And, and nothing can ever take that from us, right? <laughs> well, gotta keep moving. Oh, ammo. That wasn't ammo. Burger, though. Long last. Where is it? It's here. At long freaking last. Stolen? Still alive. Hughes slips up. Was. Was Hughes the president? Was Hughes the president in Hypnospace? I'm trying to remember. Yes? Okay. Oh, that, that totally does say the Bloids. That's cute. But what is this? And what is this? Stolen still alive. Oh! Jay Stolen! <laughs> I literally did not remember that at all. But I was looking at this and thinking like, is that Jay Tholen? <laughs> Fucking awesome. <laughs> thanks, thanks for hanging out, Wolf Clock. You have a wonderful rest of your evening. Well, oh, 
I see why I bought this at Mark. Um. Cool. Uh, because the the I and the L, the kerning kind of looks like a K, and so my brain kind of autocorrected M A K as Mark. I see. I see. Fucking Mac. All right, hold. Oh. Gross. It stinks like my Uncle Frank's farts after eating sloppo dogs. <laughs> awesome. All right. Boise, 15. Your mom's house? One. I like that it lets me go. <laughs> That's fun. That's fun. That's cute. Don't go that far, player. You'll get scared. Is, is there anything you can do with uh the the skeleton nightmare man, or is it just like a ha trick to you kind of thing? Either way, that's cute. All right, how many secrets did we get? Zero. <laughs> S secrets found. Zero out of five. Two or four. <laughs> Damn, I didn't find a single one. Oh well. I am the X-Slayer. So many double lines. Damn, I wonder where the secrets are. I, I did find the skeleton! <laughs> Boise Fall Potato Festival. Alright, here we go. Final level, right? I think. Eight secrets? Two hundred something enemies? This is where the secret is? Okay. You know what? Sure. You can you you can let me know where one goodie is. Let's save our game. I can't go in there. Dang. Hey, thank you, Looney, for the raid. Hope you had a good stream today. What was Loon streaming today? I've been so bad at keeping up with, like, what other people have been streaming lately. I haven't had much time to, like, watch streams as they go live. Fiesta? Oh, right, it's fucking Fiesta season! It's time to mash some psycho potatoes and make a potato salad out of their stupid little guts! Awesome. One of these days I gotta get around to trying a, a fucking Fiesta. It seems like a very fun way to play FF5. I actually don't remember if I've ever beaten 5 on my own, but it is still <laughs> my favorite Final Fantasy. What's the secret everyone's been raving about? I don't know. I guess we'll see. It's how you beat 5? Hell yeah. Yeah, five's fucking great. I haven't played a lot of Final Fantasies. I've played like five. Don't think I beat it myself. Oh, well, that's cute. Um, I played fourteen. I played Crystal Chronicles. Oh, I can't stick my head in either of those. I'm too short and too tall. You're that stupid. Um, I played Final Fantasy 1 on the NES. It's definitely an NES game. The secret is a little mean, but also vital to world building. Alright, uh, I do want to know then. Hit me up. 
journey into your butthole. Wonderful news, everyone. You are a butthole. You sneaky motherfucker. Alright, so... What, what, what do I have to do then to get yonder thing to keep, keep saying it's like a or whatever? At the very least good. Whoa! Hang on, who bones? Who, who bones? I want to get the music. Yo, thank you, Sewer Chick, for the raid. Yourself one of the stream today. I just I want I want to pick up the rockets. I feel like a damn fool for trying to jump on the actively spinning object, but why am I doing this when I can blow? I I always keep misremembering these dudes as like giving you action. No, they very much do not. Fall down the hole and hug me until you find a cave. This hole? This hole here? Ouch. Hold up. Okay. Who's that over there? Oh, right, I can use the chain gun as well. Let's save our game. Near the kill plane. In what direction? By the dunk, okay. Not there. Oh, let's load our game just to get our ammo back. Hmm. Towards the dark. Where was it? Your grandma's a toilet, dummy. Chase, never promise to help a high school friend that you will finish the stupid Cataclysm mod you started it together at 16. Oh. I see. Whoa! I found a secret! He will not forget. And you will regret it. Fall down the pit to respawn. Or don't. The final boss sucks because I gave up! Oh my god. The guy is delusional, but he has a kid and really thinks this game is his ticket out of being a deadbeat dollar store manager, so I pretty much have to help him now. Why did I pick up the phone? Ah, I have my own family to take care of. Oh no. 
Oh, buddy, oh. And now the moment you have all been waiting for. The one, the only. The, the final X-Slayer, the real Zane. I mean, he just looks like some dude. It's, that's fine, man. Like, I can get being a little bitter about it, but like... I don't know, he's just some guy. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I... I could maybe get being a little ornery, but... Being a bit of a dick. Smith huge shorts? Come on now. <laughs> Have you considered talking about your problems to the guy? I think he probably did, frankly. Also, yeah, those aren't shorts or <laughs> particularly big. <laughs> They're normal. <laughs> Okay, that's, that's, that's fun. <laughs> I'm glad we got to see that. Thanks for pointing that out. That, that would explain the one hole that we did just find in level 5. It's just kind of a well, oh well. Power of the x layers. funny that like oh right I'm not I don't know given that all we have of Adam is this one single snippet of him basically um, I I think it's a little bit funny that you know Zane is like just a dude trying to look out for his kid now uh, and now this dude is the dickhead <laughs> Very important context to the whole game. Yeah. Thank you for pointing that out. I I I appreciate it, and also I appreciate you like asking first <laughs> rather than just doing. It. I don't remember if Adam was a character in Hitman's Space. No. Oops! Oh, I killed you. Calling these enemies corn guys is pretty goddamn good. I meant to do that. <laughs> Hey, burgers. Good, I need this. Zane used a lottery ticket to fund this game? Ha! Did he? I didn't know that bit. I mean, I know they're doing like the mmm, ba ba mmm, kind of vocals. A boom, da ba boo in the gaming or whatever. But, like, it's funny to say it out loud like that. A boom, duck, duck, ooh, the potato kind of song. A doom, pop, ooh, my pajamas kind of song. You know? Is Adam really gonna be bitter about this if he's being paid? Let's let's go back and see. Let's let's go back and see. Is he going to be bitter about this even though he's being paid? Well, I fell down. But the point I was trying to make is yes. Like he seems pretty fucking bitter. <laughs> Kind of a goom ba ba doo my pajamas type of song. You know? What a lame baby. 
a hoom ba ha poo in the toilet kind of song. It was rhetorical, I don't need to own you this hard? What, you mean like how Adam's owning Zane? <laughs> I don't know why I've decided to just roast this one chat member's nuts, but... <laughs> I feel a little bit mean, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just think it's funny. <laughs> Wait, hang on. Wait a second. Festival. If this was the potato music. I'm loving this merry-go-nowhere ass beat. This merry-go-poop kind of bop. I gotta pick up the fucking soundtrack for this. I keep forgetting to add like more soundtracks to my my like stream playlists. I gotta do that. Do I think Chowderman wrote this? No? I don't think Chowderman was doing carnival music, was he? Oh, I love the fu <laughs> spinning barf ride <laughs> for kids! <laughs> Chatterman's not in this game? I was told otherwise, but not given more context. Well, that's exciting. That's an exciting, like, <laughs> cacophony of sound. Dumb idiot! Is this the level Zane's uncle's music is in? I think so. Hemorrhoid cream. Oh my god. This is straight up vile? Let's go. Secret. I found the butthole secret. If you don't mind, I'm trying to enjoy my butthole secret.
Just a cat. That's fine. Wasn't weren't the balloons like a like there was like a contest to submit them or something like that? One bad. They crossed out badass. <laughs> One. There we go. I was trying to take a Steam screenshot and hit the button that makes it not full screen anymore by accident. Where do you get up there? Oh, you probably fall down. That's what you do. What have we not seen? Straight up gulping. Gulping that stuff down. Like it's Thursday. <laughs> Maintenance. I need a key to open this door. Take that, you mother flipping turret pile! Nice. Yeah, I, I, I do like this running bit of like you know, um, stuff like swears and drugs and stuff. Are like, mm, that's a, that's a no no. Cause, Cause he wants his kid to enjoy it. Uh oh. Ow. What the? Oh my god, Big Bouncer? That's fun. Owie! game because like if you go out looking for it it's it's a really interesting sort of glimpse of both like yeah this this is how zane was as like a dumb punk kid and also like in some ways hey here's kind of a look into what zane is like now as a grown man trying to take care of his kid <laughs> stupid idiot and also you can do the middle finger and you can you can feed rats and shoot poop. It's fun. Is that texture just a waveform? This which one? This one? Zane fucked? Yeah, of course Zane fucked. What? How could they do this to me? Dude, check this out. What? How could they do this to me? Learning about the mind of someone through their art kind of thing? Yeah. What? I can't believe they do this to me! What the fuck? I'm... Shaken. To my core? I don't know how to go on. I can't deal with this. I'm sweating. Um, I'm fighting back tears. The three potato boys have betrayed me. I need to go and have a, have a walk and think about this. I'll be back in a couple minutes.
All right, I'm back. This this song specifically, like, there's there's been some real good music in this game. This song specifically is a hypnospace ass song, and I do mean that as a compliment. But also, man, this this song so far feels like the most hypnospace ass of all the songs. This this does sound like something I would just hear on someone's page, you know, aside from like the seepage. I would also love if there was a pizza dance. I don't know if there will be, or if there would be. I would love it. Yeah, I'll take more rockets, I love those. I love shooting those at guys and blowing them up. Is everything okay back there? You guys, you guys doing okay? All the potato cowboys, and I got an achievement for it. <laughs> awesome! <laughs> you even have to blow up the woman. That's so fucking funny. I'm the cowboy rat. My name's Rex. So I'll always be there for you, partner. I'm the cowboy rat. My name's Rex. So I'll always be there for you, partner. What the fuck are these? Oh, they're potato costumes. Okay. <laughs> this one up here, the upper middle one, just straight up looks like Dropsy. I should play Dropsy on stream. I think that could be fun. The potato wheel. Uh, thank you for the gift sub to Cowboy Rat. Yeehaw. Okay, there's no hole there. There's no hole. Well, there's a little tiny bit of a ledge there. How do we get in? But how do we get in? Oh yeah, I, I know. I, I I heard about the story of how Gianni did the rat stuff, where he literally was just like. See some drunk local bands that suck or not. I never read that sign. Gianni just like submitted a fuck ton of like rat lines. And the devs were like, okay, let's use all of them, kind of thing. I had I had I had heard. That's fun. Hey wait, there's dudes down here. I love the fucking Doppler effect. Uh, on this music. The S blade has a hack blood charge. Ow! Hey. The S blade has a hack blood charge. Hey. Rude chunks. You keep the damn meat. Be gone. There's a chance that some of the rats aren't actually rats and are mice. Yeah, one of them said that earlier. We, we heard that. We saw that. Confirmed. Oh, that's where you clowns are. 
the hell out of here! Fed up of your giggling at me! Enough! Retire! World's largest potato. I gotta see it. I gotta know. Oh, I'm running low on glass. Damn. I gotta use other weapons. Not! I'm getting shards of glass from here! If I can jump up here. And friggin' misses. So yeah, I'm basically awesome. whole bit over here. Hello? This is great. It feels illegal to be here. That's- that's- <laughs> I'm- I'm so glad that at the end of the game the levels just start falling apart like this. It's genuinely so good. found a secret! Ah, that's how you get in there. <sighs> secret psycho interaction planning. One, get Zane to kill Mevin, do my dirty work for me. Two, kill Mevin's crappy robots, especially the sexy robot, disgusting. Three, open the gateway to the Jesta dimension in the capital of Boise, and take over the whole state with the power of Jesta aliens, ha 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 ha. Four, make fun of Zane for being stupid and sexy. Then destroy him. <laughs> awesome. Some guys are having a lot of fun out there, by the way. Alright. Well, that's a secret. That's three out of eight, I think. You know that. Can I get over to that stupid platform? Can I get over to these stupid spaghetti? No! That's all my hack blood too. Oh well. See if I had more. Oh, yeah. I forgot to tell you. I am your grandma. Thanks for the heck blood charge. Thanks for the heck blood charge. Oh. Whoa! I found a secret! What the fuck? <laughs> That's awesome, dude. That's Fido. I remember Fido. Dude, how you been? Immune to all damage? That's good? You don't like that? He, that's he's the employee of the month, isn't he? Wasn't he? That was the sign they had for him as employee of the month, right? Oh, who made about the boom in the trailer? Oh, who made about the boom in the exploder? Kind of song, you know? It's like a a doom, ba a doom in the boom. A doom ba baloom and I getcha kind of song, you know? I need a key to open this door. Y you know what I'm saying? It's, it's that kind of song. It's like a, a it's like a, a boom ba baloom and I getcha type of song. It's a rat The S blade has a hack blood charge. Oh, I could also just totally go here if I wanted to. Hey, cool rat machine. You are awesome. Got any freaking shirts? 
<laughs> Wait, this car totally looks like a face because of the little skull things on it. I need a key to open this door. Oh. Huh. Oh, Neon Blair. They, like, patched that out, if I remember right. I saw people talking about how they patched that. Hmm. 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 could that be? No. No, what could that be? What's over here, actually? Oh, the start of the level. I see. Well, that's fun. Let's try from up there. Oh, we have to go all the damn way back because I came over here, huh? All right. It's time for the long walk home, the long run of shame. Oh, fuck. Well, we get to go here again. Hey, man. Yeah, I do really, really like the way this game looks. It's 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 such a fun look. I am always so so charmed by like how Doom and other similar games of the era just looked visually. Wonder if people are going to cosplay enemies in this game. I would not be surprised if people wanted to cosplay literally anything here. Not, not surprised in the slightest, no. People will dress up as anything if they like it. Sometimes people will dress up as anything if they don't like it. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge! By the way, the S-Blade does have a hack blood charge, in case you were worried. Delicious key. Ah. Uh oh! Oh no! The wheel! That's so sad or good. Oh wait, this is the potato! I thought this was just a rock! We got it with the potato! <laughs> oh, it's this song too. Burgers up there. I don't mind if I dare. I can't get like that. Oh well. Oh, 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 oh. What is the bit that I wanted to... Let's see. Let's see here. I missed it. Okay. That's the autosave. I didn't want that. There we go. Oh, it's a window. I can't go in there at all. Well, I tried. <laughs> now I know. I got counter tricked. I was like, I'm gonna do you a trick, and then I got counter tricked. I need a key to open this door. I can't open this door. Do you a green key? The S blade has a hack blood charge. Got him. I guess we go here. Over to where the wheel was. Did 
down the awful wheel-splitting path. that a crunchy style like 97 graphics can be immortalized in new games it's so distinct from being able to add music when in that era most games were silent 80% of the time yeah it's 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 very fun mix of like yeah aping on the way they were and also hey this is the way they could be given what we have and what we can do now okay I mean, we never went up here in the wrong What a damn weird meat in there. I fell again. The ah! S Blade has a hack blood charge. Ah, right, this way. Maintenance. This key. Oh, man. How about you guys be first? The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Yeah, the falling to your death animation is pretty damn good. Let's blast the gunk in there and get a goodie for it, hopefully. My health is a little low. I maybe gotta fall a little less. You think you're twisted? Guess again. Alright, back up. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Open that door. What does that do for us, though? Huh. <laughs> uh, we gotta go... Right, that bit there. Yeah, this is like obscenely a build engine ass game. It's fun. There we go. What the? His truck is here. A lot of classic Doom lovers assume this is the build engine. See, I don't actually know uh, if, like, they made their own engine or if this is, like, uh, an actual classic game or kind of thing. Oops. It's Unity? Beat. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Oh, damn, all the way back here. I should say. It is very cool to see this style of game working in Unity. So, uh, that is impressive to me. Save 
you her freaking game. Also, was there still three gems here? No. Okay, bro. Yikers? I've never seen anyone in the world pronounce that like, or spell that out like yikers. I'm delighted by that. That's awesome. Uh, let's save my game. Listen, I'm just saying, with all the tech the tech stuff that the Hypnospace universe has going on, I would not at all be surprised to hear that they invented Unity in the 90s. Oh yeah! Yeah, I guess that would happen. Yeah, I guess that would happen. Charge. You want to say this is Unreal Engine? Why? We literally just spent the past like two minutes talking about how this was a Unity game. Again. I think I would simply survive it and come out stronger. I would simply try it again and I would win. I would simply do it again and I would dodge the rock at that time. Like, it's that simple. shot a rocket at them. It's really that simple. Get the burger. I would jump up here and get my hack blood charge back. And then I would go back in. Get them again. Oh no, they're dead. Got some health. I would have maybe been pretty good if I had gotten that health the last couple of attempts, but. <laughs> Yeah, I'm way into the fucking music here. 
It's so good. Oh, I thought this was a hole leading to a secret. Damn. Oh well. No secret hole for you. Wait. Wait. Secret hole. Secret hole? Secret hole. Secret hole. Secret hole? I missed you. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's missiles. Oh, that's missiles. Oh yeah, that's missiles. Let's missiles. I need a key to open this door. I need the key to the big outside door. Maybe I could have used the other launcher on them, but whatever. The S blade oh, has a half blood launcher. charge. Oh, this game's got a good rocket launcher. Go 
gore everywhere, so I think that means I'm hitting my targets. Well, let's try again. What the fuck is an S blade? What do you mean? It's the S blade. We got it. It's it's the weapon of the slayers. I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> Does it charge? No, but you see, it builds up a hack blood charge. Your way, lane. Psycho Syndicate, if they're doing stuff like this. Stop! Like, it's not even funny. Alright, this bit here with the bridge. Can we open this door? No. So, where do we go? Hmm. How, do we, how do we get through that? Oh, 
repair a button for outside door? Fucking where? I didn't see that shit at all. Oh. I did not see that shit at all, no. that matters is the last one, but... Really? Oh my god! Yes, Blade has a I didn't save! Charge. <laughs> my ass keeps forgetting to save! <laughs> Alright, back here. Once more, but we're feeling it. Yes, Blade has a hat one charge. I didn't even see the beats. The auto saves for the level are a big yes, fuck. Blade has a half ah! blood charge. I mean, it's an old video game. The auto saves kind of are. I'm gonna save my game this time. So I'm gonna save my Ow, game. Yes, Ow, has well, a blood charge. That's fine. It's fine because I've saved my game this time. <laughs> Awesome that he has a beam attack? Yeah, it's his hidden power that he didn't that doesn't know about. It's awesome. We can't talk to him anymore. It won't let us talk to the cowboy rat anymore. Cowboy rat is cancelled. Cowboy rat is over. Party. The yes S-Blade has a hack blood charge. Go get the secret. Yeah, it's like 
I mean, there were a ton of games that did that, right? Where, like, they had a bunch of the extra weapons you could pick up. Even though, like, if you were playing through it normally, you would still have all those weapons kind of thing. And then I feel like some games maybe just do it because they felt like, well, that's the thing that games like this do, kind of thing. I wonder if there is some way to play it where you do just go through the pistols kind of thing. With your pistols out, your one top Kong, and all that. I need to stop drifting directly into pistols. I need to stop drifting directly- Why did it autosave there?! What?! What?! <laughs> That's awesome, actually! Fucking funny, actually. <laughs> I love this. All these weapons. Uh oh. Oh no. Hey, five out of eight. Not bad. Hey, one hundred percent enemies. The respawn image is a limp biscuit logo. No, it's Zane. What do you mean? It's him. You, you, it's the same one you get on the on the level complete screen. It's Zane. <laughs> What's Limp Biscuit? <laughs> Crevasse of Repugnant. No going back. Three secrets here. Okay. But where? <laughs> Wait, hang on. That's that's the weird nightmare baby, and that's and that's that's the sex machine. Found a secret. The S Blade has a half blood charge. That like weird, weird sound it makes is like some donkey pump. The S Blade has a half blood charge. Yeah, see, some of the brands are changed for copyright reasons, but I think stuff like Grey's League is yes, have all that, a you know? charge. Like, haha, it's a pistol. Owie. But I guess it's both. Who are shooting beams in some way? Can't shoot the baby. You cannot blast the baby. Don't try for a baby blast. It's not gonna work. Don't do it. Don't don't do it. Secret again. Whoa! I found a secret! Oh, 
happened up there? <laughs> okay, that guy's gonna Let's not use the rocket launcher close range anymore. Because it hurt and killed me. Wait, okay, well, let's rocket launch again. This is what I get for switching off the rocket launcher. Immediately I am given reason to use the rocket launcher. Now what's down here? Whoa! I found a secret! Oh. Okay. I have a feeling. Just the other side. Okay. Anyway, back up from here. But if you if you bunny jump real good, you don't get hurt because you're not touching the lava long enough. Smart, 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 smart. If you're fast enough, fire don't hurt. Eat it, dipweed. Oh, that damn spawner. There's scary saw blades and stuff here, so let's be careful. I'm falling. There we go. The S blade has a hack blood charge. Okay, scary. Of falling mostly. I fell. <laughs> let's do that again. No, the, ga the game literally does tell us about the chain gun thing. Yeah, I know. I've been doing it. You know, I'm getting a sneaking suspicion that I'm not really meant to jump on the thin platform and use it as a guide. Just a bit of a feeling I'm beginning to get. However. However. What if I did? Never mind. It's easier. It's not. Feel the power of the X layers. Why? I don't see any more dudes, so. Okay. Thanks for not shooting a rocket at me. It was really nice of you to do that. Blood charge. Nice, nice. Oh! Hello. Let's save game. Oh, there's no. That doesn't count as a secret. Huh, okay. Sure. I question it a little bit. But I mean, I got a pretty nice amount of hack blood now, so I can't complain too much. Has a hack blood charge. And good news about the S blade. Hey. Who's, who's over here? Dude, this is so awesome. What if there's three million dudes who just shoot them all at once? How would you deal with that? Thankfully, some rats are here, so. Right, it's fine. I think it's 
bombs. I should take care of that. Thank you, rats. Lane is awesome. That's so cool. It's the dang truck again. That's Mevin's big rig truck. What is he doing here with all these psychos? Time to hit the road. <laughs> Time to hit the road. All right, here we go. I am the X Slayer. I fell down the psycho trap hole and then blew it up. Now in. Over. You can't be calling that shit over the road. Come on, man. That's awesome. <laughs> All right. You got me pretty damn good there. There's more levels than I thought. that in your turret hole and smoke it. People were like, yeah, it's just seven. This is like, what, eight or nine by this point? Everyone is forgetting about the bolt. It's so sad. Oh my god, wait! Are there people that don't know about big rigs over the road racing? This is so exciting. I, this is so exciting. I get to talk about one of my favorite video games ever. Big rigs over the road racing. It is, uh, or was, I suppose, for a little while, an infamously bad trucking game. Uh, in that it basically was not at all uh, feature complete in any possible way. A um, bunch of trucks that you could pick from just crashed the game. There was like two maps and a bunch of them straight up didn't work. Um, you could go outside of the bounds of the map whenever you wanted to. Uh, acceleration forward normal driving was really, really slow with, like, weird momentum. If you held reverse, there was no speed cap on reversing. You could get infinite speed forever, but the momentum for reversing stopped immediately as soon as you let go of it. Um, and so on and so forth. There's... I, I would need to do an entire thing dedicated to talking about big rigs over the road racing if you wanted to hear from me specifically about big rigs over the road racing. And so instead I encourage you to go look up big rigs over the road racing. Um, straight up. Oh, right. <laughs> There's like races against the CPU, but you always win because they stop driving right at the right at the finish line right before crossing it. So you always win. Um, you have to pass through checkpoints, but no, you don't. And whenever you win a race, you get a three-handled trophy that says, You're winner. Y-O-U apostrophe R-E, winner. You're winner. If you've ever seen anyone say, You're winner, or if they've ever posted a three-handled trophy that said, You're winner, they were talking about big rigs over the road racing. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't it sold in retail stores? Yes, it was. Yes, it was. You could get it on a CD. <laughs> I... Admittedly haven't spent really any time at all looking into it, so it could be as easy as just going for a fucking Google search. I'm pretty sure it's abandoned aware by this point, but like... I've always wanted to play Big Rigs for myself. I've always wanted to play to to play big rigs for myself, and I haven't, and I want to. 
For years as a youngin, I was terrified that if I tried to play big rigs over the road racing, um, it would actually cause permanent damage to my hardware. I don't know why I thought that. I just thought if any game was certain to do that, it would be big rigs over the road racing. So I never played it. You personally like A Winner Is You, but that's different. A Winner Is You is from, like, um, some Japanese NES game that got translated weird. Your winner is from some kind of <laughs> Eastern European video game that got translated weird. Easily found on Abandonware sites. Let's fucking go! It's like how I very easily found Ratatouille on, like, Abandonware sites, and then immediately also found a bunch of people saying, well, this works when you first download it and play it. Immediately after that, it never runs again. Uh, so I had to go track down the GameCube version instead. And that's how I found multiple uploads of multiple different versions of prototypes of Ratatouille for the GameCube, which is exciting. <laughs> I do, I do want to stream those at some point, but I also have to make sure that, like, they're not, like, a visual nightmare to look at. Because I remember some people saying there was some, like, flashing in the, in the prototypes, so I'd have to check that for myself. Would have to look more into that. Uh, anyways, I've, I've been rambling and gambling about, uh, <laughs> big rigs over the road racing and forgot that I had to get up and stretch. Um... A winner is you is from Pro Wrestling for the NES. Thank you. Um, yeah, I want to... <laughs> Puzz talked me into streaming Ratatouille for the GameCube, by which I mean we watched the, the GDQ speedrun that happened recently, and we're like, what the fuck is the deal with this game? It's so funny. Let's play it. Uh, so that'll happen eventually. <laughs> anyway, I'm getting up to stretch, and then uh, let's finish this game. Be back in a few.
Howdy. Howdy. Man, I wasn't quite expecting the stream to go this long, but... I mean, I did tell myself, yeah, I play through these games slow. We're gonna be here for a little while. So I guess that's on me and also to be expected. Uh, I'm having a real good time, though. Happy to be chewing through this game, noodling about through it, finding little bits and bobs. Game's good. It's like... It's, it's, it's this really interesting sort of microcosm of, like, what uh, Hypnospace was really good at and, like, what uh, Jay Tholen's games, at least from what I've heard, I've only played Hypnospace and also this one now, um, are really good at. Where it's like, yeah, here's, like... A, he, he, here's this, like, glimpse into the lives of, like, a bunch of fucking weirdos. Um. And weirdos being meant in, like, a, like an interesting positive way, not, like, a point and laugh kind of way, and then going, like, alright. Um. Can you show empathy for these guys? Will you? Kind of thing. Here's, here's these glimpses into, like, who they are and why and how they are. Uh, sort of chronicling that over time. It's cool. It's cool. It's like, yeah, it's 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 a fun retro shooter. I'm I'm going around, I'm shooting the rocket launcher at people. And it's a little hard, you know, talk about this stuff out loud when I'm trying not to get shot by <laughs> clown aliens from the scary brain zone, but it's like, yeah. Here's Here's this, like, sort of glimpse into the life of, like, a dude circa 1998. And here's other glimpses into, like, his life circa, what, 2023. Here's, here, here's some hows and whys of why he's like that, maybe. Here's some little looks into the way things are. You're not gonna get the whole picture, because you're not them. They're not gonna get the whole picture of you. What are they like? How are they like? What do you think? Do you care? Can you care? Will you? Should you? Why not? I'm, I'm very tired and a little bit just kind of rambling at this point. <laughs> and I feel like I could maybe get a much more compelling and poignant point across if it wasn't almost one in the morning. And I was writing this down and Lethal Lava Land wasn't playing, but like, I don't know. Uh, I just, I like... At the core of these games, how human they always feel. Zane pushing 40 with a kid and a job he hates but dreams of riding that indie game wave, not really having the full means to. Yeah, it's, it feels like this perfect, um... This, this perfect sort of distilling of, like, what was at the, the core of Hypnospace, what the ethos of that game was, and taking it and, like, laser-focusing it in on, like, a much more smaller-scope experience of, like, hey, here's this character that, that people, like, really got attached to in this in this video game. What if we did more with him, about him, in, like, a medium and, like, with a trajectory that could basically only really happen with this character? It's awesome. It's awesome. It, it would be really easy to go, like, oh, you know... Here's, here's the Zane kid. He's just some snot-nosed brat. Uh, it would also be very easy to go, here's the Zane kid. He's some snot-nosed brat, but also he had dad issues, so you have to forgive him right now for everything he ever did right now, right now, right now. And, like, there are plenty of stories like that. Sometimes they end up okay. Sometimes they're, a lot of the time, they just are flat. They're boring. 
This is this is not that because it's going. Hey, here's here's this person and like not the entire spectrum of what they are because you would have to be them to get that. But here's just like a ton about you know who they are and how they are. Let's explore that. Let's let's think about that through the medium of them trying to make something and express themselves and like you know. Dude. Swing your arms from side to side. Come on, I'm time to go with Mario. Take him out and put him there. We're gonna find him now. He's the Mario. What the fuck was I saying? I feel like I went into a coma. <laughs> A lot of people never really grew up, they just became bigger teenagers. See, I think it'd be really easy to look at a lot of stuff about Zane and just go like, yeah, he he never grew up, he's still the way he is. And at the same time, he extremely grew up and changed and is a different person now. While, while still in a lot of ways, being himself. You're, you're, you're still the same person you are. You're still the same person you've always been. You're no longer the person you were 10 years ago, 20 years ago. You are not the same person you were yesterday. But you're still you. You're still the same person. Did I end up doing the bonuses? I haven't beaten the final boss. I went up and took a break, and when I sat back down, I was like, man, this game is good. I want to talk about it and, like, be bad at talking about it. Because I like this game a whole lot and want to put into words how much I think this thing is really fucking cool. And, like, the, the little glimpses you get of, like, yeah, this is a thing that he couldn't do and finish on his own. Uh, and so, like, there were other people that helped work on this. And the sort of, like, brief touching on that and the ways that the games do and the one secret we found that was like, yeah, here's, here's, here's how the fucking programmer feels who is, like, actually a professional programmer um, trying to look out for... Um, himself and his family and now he's also trying to do that for Zane kind of thing it's it's interesting it's cool we we we, we get characters that feel like people which is yeah that's what you want to do with a fucking character but like the entire point of it is hey let's imagine these are people and not just like you know Characters in a story. The characters are the story, kind of thing. It's awesome. See, this is him not necessarily being how he is, but him revisiting his childhood. I, I think there's a lot of stuff in this that is a reflection of how he was then, and is also a reflection of how he is now. Like, they're, they're hand in hand. They're not always the same. But that's what makes them the same. You know? It's just, I don't, it, it's, it's such an interesting medium of exploring this too, just through like, yeah, here's, here's like a fucking shooter this dude made when he was a kid. And then little bits and pieces that you can like, you know, find and see through that. Really exploring that. The S-Blade isn't just hack blood charges. Well, I mean, it's not, but also it is mostly just the S-Blade, which gets a hack blood charge. <laughs> I don't know. I, again, I feel like I, I'm kind of talking myself in circles and not really vocalizing the point that I want to try and make here because I'm tired and I'm a little bad at explaining myself out loud. Uh, but... I don't know. What what this game does and like how it does it and how Jay Tholen and the team that works on these games go about like writing the things they do and making the things they do and ex expressing the art they want to express and make and share with people is just it is a really really cool way um of using like an active interactive media or medium, I suppose, to to explore these kinds of stories in like a in like a really interesting way. And also the fucking wet meat on the ground all splatting everywhere. <laughs> awesome. This, this 
dude is like goofy and weird and abrasive. Also a dad looking after his kid and also Yes, Blade has a half blood has charge. Has half blood charge. He's kind of goofy and juvenile. Yeah. There's a car here. Do you care? Can you care? Won't you care? He never swears. And he loves his mama very much. Blade does have a hack blood charge, so. And the Sloppo's truck has exploded. And we blew up Sloppo's. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Just, I don't know, man. Video games are cool. I'm glad that something like this gets to exist. I'm glad I get to play it. I'm glad I get to share it with you all. Yes, Blade has a hack blood charge. Thanks for tuning in tonight, y'all. Stuff is cool. Getting to talk about stuff is cool. You can feel the power of the X layers. Sure will, dude. Yeah, it sure does say glass shark. It's been saying glass shark all game. <laughs> It does, and it is. I can it for 14 months. <laughs> Finally, I can kill you. Zane, I have been waiting my whole life for this. Too bad I 
did that. He did say that kind of like Gabe Newell. That's true. I don't say any Slayer. <laughs> the achievement description said, Thanks for making me work on weekends, Kevin. Dot dot dot. I mean, Mevin. <laughs> Surprised I beat Mevin first try? Why? I'm good at video games. <laughs> I'm a gamer. I'm an X Slayer. Whoa, Mevin! You were always ugly, but now you look like an old leather bike seat somebody peed on and left out in the sun. <laughs> Looks like the Dollar Shaver just got a new manager. <laughs> oh, Mevin. I would be disappointed about this if you weren't such a sucky, stupid, pervert boss. You were weak. And you smelled like turds and rotten fish. Uh-oh. No matter. Now the real games begin. Watch out, Zane. Something is coming. From somewhere you least expect it. I am the Z Slayer. Shut the fuck up. Games are awesome. Breaking news. The evacuation <laughs> has ended after famous CEO, comic book artist, and final X Slayer Zane Lofton defeated the Psycho Syndicate and saved everyone. Thank you, Zane. To make it so the Psycho Syndicate never returns, I am now training students to be X Slayers. Enroll now in the X Slayer Training School at the Secret Training Dojo today. Or else. <laughs> the end. Dude, video games are so cool. Oh my god, we get these bug to mask credits, let's go! Hey, here's all the people that helped work on this. Hang on. I, I need to watch these fucking credits again. I think I saw a name I recognized. Hang on. I mean, I recognize Gianni. That's a name I know. And Tosh Ritter. But, like, I gotta go back. We gotta go back. Hang on. Fucking pull a hoka. So I didn't read it wrong. I didn't realize Palahoko worked on this! That's awesome. All these balloons! Jazz Mickey? I'm not really too- Farts. Awesome. Farts credits. I don't- I don't super keep up with, uh, a lot of the Doom scene nowadays. I guess I never really did. Inventing the word shark! That's Mama Luigi to you! <laughs> uh, there- there- there is no exclamation point lurk command. You don't gotta say anything in chat to do that. You can just hang out. <laughs> Yo, thank you, Lake Mojave. 
for the raid. Hope you had yourself a wonderful stream. We did just beat uh, a Slayer's X. Bonus stuff unlocked in the training dojo. How do I get to that? Is it just like the start game or is it load game or is it what? What, what do I press to do that? You, you can let me know. Start game? Okay. Ah! Level select. Mikey's head? Uncle Gopher's house. Welcome to Boise. We can also just select it here, it looks like. Hmm. Let's check out the first level. Right I've seen it. <laughs> I've seen that. <laughs> yeah, the music in this is really good. Alright, so, from the dojo. Alright, we have... Uh, hmm, I, I have a feeling as to what, uh, Uncle Gopher's house might be referencing, given the name Gopher House. <laughs> uh, we got Mikey's head, and Boise Downtown. Let's enter Mikey's head first. Really good animation. This is my third Cataclysm map. It's pretty awesome still. Come closer next time. If you zoom out, this map looks like something cool. <laughs> this map looks like something cool. <laughs> An awesome level by Zane Loft. Copyright 2000, Big 2 Inc. Oh, cute. Room over room, enemy placement, and fast cat enhancements. Adam Chase. Oh my god. Bro, I'm gonna the damn way. I need a key to open this door. Owie! Let's see, can I hit the map here? No. Oh man. Oh, this is exciting. This is. <laughs> This, this truly is baby's first mod for a game like this, and I love this. This is the last one. They don't tell you to do them in any order. You can pick literally any of them. What a lame baby. It's fine. using the S-Blade? I'm nostalgic for those days. As soon as I got that talent, I had no use for it. The S-Blade has a hack blood charge! Was a pair of pants? Why? It's a it's a barrel. Right. Six 
get things back on the menu, girls. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Wolves can't do that, that's illegal. You can't strafe on me. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. There we go. Oh. The flat uniform textures, the super sharp geometric shapes. Oh man, oh, oh man. It's beautiful in here. It's beautiful in here. The music. Heaven is like this for someone. You were lame. There we go. This level gives you dark forces. Honestly, it does. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. There's also like one or two specific levels from um I can't remember which dude there. One or two. That like extremely reminds me of this area. Oh you bet I wanna see. Oh, this is my third cataclysm Damn, okay. map. It's pretty awesome still. I guess it makes sense that we don't have here. If you zoom out, this map looks like something cool. Owie. Gotta be a little more careful, but also make more saves. I keep forgetting. zoom out yet? I don't think we can. I didn't see this last time. Okay. Ah. Hey, bro. Ah. Hey, bro. Check the map. I did. There's nothing. We haven't found the map item, so there's nothing on the map. Ah. Hey. Owie. Enough of shooting at me. Pretty stupid. <laughs> there we go. My god, it really is full of questionable questionable platforming design. Ow. Ouch. How do I? Mm -hmm. <laughs> This is awesome. I'm so enamored with this. How do you make that jump, I wonder? Can you? Do you? Oh yeah, the chain gun. I can use that for a jump. Yeah, totally it. Alright. Just have to not get stuck. Let's save our game. What was Zane thinking? Probably thinking, man, this level's gonna be so cool. Ah. 
fuck's sake. <laughs> I beefed it! I beefed it! There we go. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> okay, that one's on me. I did not commit enough. Dude, I'm straight up beef training it right now. There we go. Ah! Red car? Looks like there's no fall damage. Alright, get further. Is this moving up and down? No. Did Zane play Daikatana? I would be so sad if Daikatana existed in the Zane world. I need a key to open this door. Ah, double door. I see, I see. <laughs> Get him with those pistols. Get him a Kimba. Let's save our game again. Let's save our game again on Mikey's head. Anything down here? Hmm. I'm gonna say no. I'm living my decision. All oh, right, the rocket. with the wrong X-Layer. There we go. All right. Let's save that game. In the Hypnospace universe, Doom never came out and John Romero made an amazing version of Daikatana that didn't sell well. <laughs> I, I can see it now. The ads being like John Romero's desperate to make you his friend. John Romero is trying so hard to make you his bud. How sad for him. Alright, I can hit F5 to a quick save. I should be doing more. Doom 2 in Spain only a bootleg for a parallel universe developed by Juan Romero. That's a cute idea. Ouch. Ladies! Ah! Oh, ladies! Oh, green card. Okay. Whoa! I found a secret! It's... Really fucking funny secret. Ah, the way out. I see, I see. Two secrets. Okay. Emma for me, Emma for Holly. Yes, yes. Where's the fucking... Oh, I guess the wolf women just despawned. Did I get to play Sigil yet? Yet? Is that a thing I said I would play? Because I straight up don't know what that game is. Entirely possible this is a thing that was talked about on stream at some point and I've forgotten about it completely. That happens to me a lot. That name rings zero bells to me, however.
sends fortress from the better world. Ah. Yes, Blade has a hack blood charge. A new episode for Doom made by Romero. Oh, oh, right. Yeah, I vaguely remember that. No, never played it. Maybe someday. The S Blade has a half blood charge. specifically interested in seeing more Doom mods or wads or whatever, uh, perhaps consider looking at my schedule for this week, smiling so sweetly, smiling so sweetly. I'm looking forward to it, Tim. Plop. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Damn, something in that room is mad. Mad and angry and not happy. Less. Just kidding. I meant to do that. Idiot. Blade has a hack blood charge. Hey, bro. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Got him. This game is all about farting and shitting, and it's basically awesome. House in blue, but imagine. Okay. Be be honest with me here. Be completely be completely serious with me here. Why do people keep typing the word house blue? Explain it to me. Explain it to me right now. Explain it to me right now. You have to explain it to me right now. I'm putting all of you on the spot. House of Leaves reference. I never read that. I was very surprised to see suddenly a bunch of people get really into that novel, like, recently. That I was just kind of surprised, and I was like, that's not um, a recent novel. Is it? is it having a resurgence? I feel like... Literally, every, like, ten to- whenever I look at my Tumblr dashboard, which isn't often, I feel like I see it at least once a day or two. Is it specifically because of my house? Interesting. Yeah, I- I, I don't know a lot about what House of Leaves is about. I don't know a lot about what my house ends up being about. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Uh, all I know is I've seen people compare the two. I'll tell your mom that I blew you up when I get with her tonight. Now what did you do? Now what did you do? Now what did that button do? My house ended up so popular the author of House of Leaves tweeted about it? Huh. Wait. Yes, 
damn wall. Get out of here. It's gonna blow. Extremely <laughs> teenager wanting to talk about things he likes. This map is fucking awesome. I didn't jump high enough. The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Oh, I didn't jump late enough, brother. One of my old Cataclysm maps that looks like Mikey Psyche's head. Is what that said. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> no going back. Isn't that an anime? What the hell is anime? You just messed with the wrong X Slayer. This better be what I hope. Level. Cool truck. Really cool truck. You wonder how Grover House is doing these days? What makes you say that? A lot of things bring up all of a sudden. It's the second Cataclysm map I ever made. I was 15 when I did this one. Uncle Gopher built this house all by himself. We did Christmas here a few times. It was awesome. <laughs> Anyways, welcome to Gopher House. Your grandma's a toilet, dummy. Dummy. This map is so fucking big. Why is it so big? The S Blade has a hack blood charge. I'm like actually intimidated by the size and also the fucking darkness of it. No secrets, okay. I am so fucking glad. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> the pipe to the garage! <laughs> I'm so glad that <laughs> Jay Tholen put another fucking Grover House reference in his video game. <laughs> One time, I fell down these stairs right out that window. Oops. PWL. <laughs> Uh, 
<laughs> I could literally die right now. Owie. And I would be a happy woman. Satisfied with my life. I forgot to tell you, I got with your grandma. <laughs> Scary purple door. Oh my god. You will go down I'm there? I'm awesome. I don't, I'm not ready. I don't want to go. I'm literally bursting with laughter as we speak. Oh my god. I'm so glad that even to this day, all these years later, Grover House still has such a fucking chokehold on, like, people's minds. As it does to me. Sexy both on and offline. <laughs> Yeah, I I would be very surprised if they somehow managed to stuff in like verbatim a load bearing drywall joke. Like I would be shocked. Frankly. This fucking car. This fucking car. The, wait, the way this door opens! Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm obsessed! The staggered garage, yep. Anyways, into the damn pit we go. Dude, the piles of gold? Also, Lorak, you went to Grover House, I'm excited. Stash. Go for stash. We're rich. We're rich. This is how he could afford to make the house. Ah, out we go. Where is the exit? How do I how do I leave this level? Where's the exit? Is there an exit? Is there genuinely no exit? Is there actually no exit? In the backyard. I think got a key, but like... God, the fucking pipe. The pipe outside. Ah, here we go. The room I didn't want to go into was the one that went down uh, into the gold room, which I did go into eventually. <laughs> Man, what a fucking level! The X Slayer, my uncle Gopher's house. <laughs> Zero percent, even though there's none of them? Come on now. <laughs> You're tricking me. What what a good fucking bonus at the end of the game, yeah. We do have one map left. It is 130. Fuck it. If if I end up doing stream tomorrow afternoon a little later than I intended, that's fine. I can live with that. Boise downtown. What's 100% a zero? Don't worry about it. That's the answer. The music! The music?! Wait, interact? Ah, oh, 
the perfect black void that you can't go through. Why was it telling me to interact? I saw it again. Mystery. This was going to be the best map of Slayer's X. The Big Potato. The city of Boise itself. <laughs> My publisher said I don't have time to finish it. And I ran out of lotto money. Oh no! Come closer next time and I'll kick you in the nards! Oh no! <sighs> oh, that's sad. <laughs> Aww. I'm actually devastated hearing that, honestly. Actual, genuine pang of sadness in my heart, especially the way you said that. Oh my god. When, when I said I was expecting this game to emotionally devastate me, I was mostly joking. I, I straight up, I'm not expecting there's ever going to be a Slayer's X2. I think it'd be really fucking funny if there was. And I think that way it could be interesting to go a lot harder into, like, exploring Zane as an adult kind of thing, because it wouldn't just be like, yeah, here's a thing I made as a kid. It would be, here's a sequel to a thing I made as a kid and then had to make it as an adult. But Slayer Zed? Right, yeah, th isn't that, like, such a fucking 15-year-old with huge grand dreams of making a cool video game type idea to go like, yeah, I've already got my sequel hook. I already know what the sequel's gonna be like. Not knowing anything at all about what the sequel's gonna be like, other than wouldn't it be cool if there was one? To, to me, the entire joke of Slayer's X2, Slayer Z, is that it would be very difficult for that to exist. It would be a different kind of interesting and funny if the devs do end up making it in the end. But to me, that's what the joke is right now as it stands. You know? Does that does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. Take that, you mother flipping turret pile! I, I don't know if Slayer Z is going to be a thing in um, Dream Settler. Because, like, isn't that set in. The 2000s? Isn't that game set in the 2000s? This game is set in 2023. It'd be cool if we got more Zane in it, but I'm not expecting Slayer's X2 to be in that. What year is this game set? So the fiction This is where my mom oh. took me to trade squishers, but some idiot stole my collection. And I never got it back. Police don't do crap. I had 20 sparklies because I was really good at making deals in school. Anyway, who cares? Squishers suck. <laughs> oh, buddy. He's right, though. Pops suck. What the fuck was I saying? So, alright, the, the fiction of this video is that Hypnospace Outlaw takes place in like the 1999-2000 of this game's universe. Of this series' universe, I suppose you could say. Um, and Zane is a character in that. And in this universe in 1998, he started working on a video game with a friend of his. Uh, and, you know, this is idea idea a kid has to make a video game. Nothing really comes of it. Uh, they, they make some maps, whatever. Um, years pass. Years pass. Zane grows up, is like in his late 30s or, 40, or early 40s or something like that. Has a kid. Uh, has a job. Trying to make ends meet. Uh, wants to make things better for his kid. And then is like... And then finds like... The old video game that he made. 
uh, and is like, man, wouldn't it be cool if I could make this? Wins exactly enough lottery money to pay for his old high school friend, who is a programmer professionally, to make this. So that he can try and make money off of it to, like, you know, help out his family. In, you know, presumably around the year 2023 or so, given how much time has passed since Hypnospace. It, it, it takes place in our real-life current year. Basically. If that makes sense. You just messed with the wrong X-Layer. That's the... That's, that's the fiction. Slayer's X is canon. Is what you need to know. Oh shit, I gotta go stretch. I gotta go break. Um, <laughs> this is gonna be the final break, and then we're gonna finish this level, and then we'll, you know, sign out for the night. Final thoughts. Uh, and all that. So I get up the stretch, get a bit more water, and I'll see you in a couple minutes. Alright, I'm back. I am very excited to see uh, more of Dream Settler. I, like, genuinely, like, genuinely, I cannot remember the last time I was this excited for, like, a video game's imminent release. N not, not even imminent, just the idea of a video game's release. It it's not coming out anytime soon. I'm not fooling myself, but, like, I can't remember the last time I was this excited hearing, like, hey, Here's a video game that's being worked on. It'll be coming when it's ready. 
I wasn't... I wasn't this excited about Tears of the Kingdom. <laughs> like, I've, I've let myself play a little bit of Tears of the Kingdom. It's a very fun video game. It's a very cool video game. Nowhere near as excited for it as I am for, like, Dream Settler. The, the, the only other ones I can think of are, like, fucking... The Outer Wilds DLC and, like, Citizen Sleeper 2. <laughs> Maybe the fucking Mario RPG remake. N Nero Diver is another one that I'm really hyped to. Sorry, this is this is since we're like winding down and I can't imagine there's too terribly much left before I finish stream. This is just the bit where I talk about stuff, I guess, that I'm excited for. Indie wishlist is existentially upsettingly terrifying. Oh, I feel that there is. There's so much cool stuff out there in the world, and so much cool stuff is still being made and worked on. Uh, they gotta stop. <laughs> they need to... The, they, they need NASA to invent a genie in a lab, so I can wish for all game developers to take a five to ten year paid vacation where they don't work on anything. At all. So that I have time to play all the other things I want to play. It, it needs to happen. It needs to happen. Excited for the Penny's Big Break game? I am- s I forgot about Penny's Big Break. I'm so pumped for that. I am so excited to see, um, the Sonic Mania devs doing a dope fucking looking 3D platformer. That shit looks awesome. Um, I saw a message earlier that I wanted to just point out and bring up, uh, Beetle Buddy talking about uh, the Zane stuff, you know, in the fiction of it, saying, and I quote, I took it as he wanted to make this super vain thing he did as a kid because he still thinks it's awesome, and in spite of wanting to do stuff for his family, he spent a lot of money on making this because Zane is still kind of a dork, hence why the voices are from 2023. I think it can be both. I think it could be the thing you said and also the thing I said. Like, I... It, it can very much be, hey, I have a bunch of money. I have a chance to, like, use this and invest this in something that will help out my family. And also, hey, dude, here's this fucking thing I made when I was a, when I was a teenager. I was so smart and cool back then. What if I simply made this? <laughs> what, what if I simply funded this and everyone will love it and I'll get a million dollars? Like, it's both, and I love that. <laughs> it's, it's, it's such a fun exploration of, like, this character and, like, watching the trajectory of this character that you got to see bits of in the previous game in, like, a way that feels so true and fitting to, like, the character while also giving them room to grow. Room to grow in spite of, you know, still being themselves. It's great! It's great! It's great! <laughs> I, I have a lot of thoughts about this video game. I, I could straight up sit down and write an essay specifically about uh, Slayer's X. And I don't know how much of that is it's almost two o'clock brain giving me really bad ideas, but also... <laughs> oh man, what a, what, a, what a cool thing these people have made. I'm so glad I got to experience it. I'm glad I got to share it with y'all. He could have paid someone well-known, but specifically went to his old friend because he still appreciated him. Yeah, I think that's really sweet, honestly. In kind of a... Again, in, in kind of a weird man. You're, why did you do that kind of way, you know? Which is perfect for Hypnospace. Uh, thank you, Serony, for the raid. I hope you had yourself a wonderful stream today. Um, I'm just kind of having a sit and talking before I hop back into the end of the video game. The, the bonus stuff. Um, but yeah. Penny's Big Break is looking really cool. Uh, yes, Cheesy X. Read Only Memories Neurodiver. Is, uh, what, what I meant by Neurodiver. That, uh, that game has looked real cool from the bits I've seen of it. I haven't been following it too in-depth, but I've really liked what I've seen. Uh, I think... Unless, like, something has come up or changed or anything like that, I think what the plan is, is still, is I want to play that together with Katie. Maybe on, like, her stream or her channel if she's still up for streaming it. I think that'd be a fun time. Um... 
You thought Penny Snap Cube was involved with Penny's big break? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> People and things can be named Penny. <laughs> Like everything with the word Holly in it is related to me. You 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 look at Holly in Super Lesbian Animal RPG, you look at that character. And you can certainly sit there and think, yeah, that's a character um aligned with what I think of about Holly Holotones, sure. I got nothing to do with it. <laughs> I got nothing to do with it. I I didn't invent the damn plant. I didn't invent the tree, the berry. <laughs> If I did, they better start fucking paying me royalties. Give me three million dollar and I can just, you know, live in a fucking house with my wife and give the rest out to other people. <laughs> Stuff like this reminds you how much you love video games and the creative passion that goes into it most of the time. Yeah, like, I think it's very, very easy to get doom and gloom about, like, the state of the industry, because it's very easy to do that about a lot of industries nowadays, or a lot of things in general nowadays, but... I don't know. Things in some places are bad. Things in some places are getting better. Slower than they ought to, but getting better. There's still wonder in the world. You know? There's, there's, there's still cool people doing their damnedest to make cool things and share that with us. And that's great. I straight up, if I, if I can find a way to, like, squeeze that into what I normally do, I want to try and, like, stream a lot more, like, indie games and smaller games and fucking weird games. Because, like, getting to show those off and explore those and talk about those and showcase those is really cool. Like, I've, 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 I've straight up had a couple of times where, like, I've, I've had people who, like, made a video game that I really, really enjoyed and admired and, like, had a great time with reach out to me and be like, hey, I really appreciate you, like, you know, showing off my game and talking about my game. It got a bunch of people to, like, go out and pick it up for themselves and, like, we could actually see, like, that little bump up in, like, you know, sales or discussion or whatever. And it's like, damn. I don't know. I, I I feel really lucky to have a position like this where I can be like, hey, here's a cool thing. Let's talk about it. Go look at it. Go check it out. And there's analgesic, analgesic. I've never been sure how to pronounce that, but that's the devs that made um, that's the devs that made Stephanie, right? And I always forget the name of um. The other ones they did. But god, their games are cool. I still need to sit down and play them. Anodyne, that's it, thank you. Yeah, the the fucking I there was a trailer I saw for like their new game at like one of the summer games things, and I was sitting here thinking, like, wow, this looks really cool. This looks like it was extremely inspired by like Anodyne, doesn't it? And I'm sitting here and then they show, oh yeah, from the makers of Anodyne, and I'm just like, oh. No, never mind. They were <laughs> egg on my face. <laughs> I I really do need to sit down and play more of their games. Their games look cool as fuck. I have loved everything I've seen about them. Need to play them. Need to play them. Need to play them. I think I want to stream them. I drink water. Making stuff is cool. Getting to share things with people is cool. I don't know, it's like... And you'll have to forgive me for being sappy here, I guess. Um, I don't exactly make a shit ton of money doing what I do. Because let's be real, uh... <laughs> My audience isn't exactly a bunch of rich investors. Uh, it's a bunch of <laughs> broke-ish to okay uh, people like me kind of thing, you know? 
Uh, I'm making enough to get by. I'm very thankful that I get to do that while also being able to, like... Like, like I'm, I'm, I'm thankful that I'm making enough to get by and also get to, like, do stuff like this that is as, like, interesting and engaging as it is to, like, sit down and go, Hey, here's a thing I think is neat. Let's look at it together. Let's explore it together. Let's talk about it together. What do we think? What's going on? Here's a thing maybe you haven't heard of that you otherwise might not have been able to hear about. Take a look at it. Isn't it cool? I don't know, I just... I'm, I'm very appreciative of the fact that folks enjoy me doing that enough that they want to keep supporting me doing that, I suppose, is what I'm trying to get at. So thanks a lot, y'all. I really appreciate it. Seeing people connect with art you also connect with in their own specific ways, one of the most gratifying things in the world. God, yeah, isn't it just? Isn't it just? Or hell, seeing people connect with a thing that you, like, worked on. That's awesome. That's cool. What a, what, what a cool little slice of, like, the world and existence we live in that we all get to, you know sit around the fire together like this and talk about cool things and cool stories we have seen. I don't know. I don't know. That shit's cool. Let's go back to Boise, Idaho. <laughs> oh shit! What the hell? <laughs> That's awesome! Oh, I was just here. Yo, thank you, Dominic, for the resub. Much appreciated. Keep on keeping on and capturing all the weird and heartfelt stuff. And never pouring out your heart about it either. Aw, I will certainly try my fucking damnedest. Also, hey, straight up. Um, if any of y'all out there aren't, like, already following Dominic and checking out his stuff, uh, just a bunch of real cool... Uh, write-ups for, like, different press outlets about, This like, is the oh, Idaho D.O.H. Hang on. We went there a lot when I was little, and the front desk lady gave me a backpack full of stick bricks. She was awesome! Fuck yeah. <laughs> Dominic does a lot of really cool, like, writing and talking about, uh... I need a key to open this door. ...video games and, like, indie games and things like that, and showcases a lot of really cool stuff. Uh, has... Through their work, introduced me to a lot of really cool shit, uh, which I am eternally thankful for. Yeah, go uh. God, you, you stupid idiot! So check him out on Twitter. There's links to the stuff he writes there, certainly. What is a DOH? Is that like a thing? <laughs> what? The S Blade has a hack blood charge. Department of Housing. I guess that would make sense, given the context, yeah. Damn. Could also be Department of Health because of the beef brain thing, yeah. Possible. Bouncy! Bouncy! <laughs> Dumb idiot! The S Blade has a hack blood charge! <laughs> oh, 
Oh, right, we already been here. Oh, it was fun to jump in again. Where did we do this bit? Alright, this was the DOH bit. Rumbling by old Idaho penitentiary would be. The psychos took over the jail and locked up the president in there. But now it just looks like blocks. <laughs> it was so messed up when the actual psychos really did this. And it's such a shame we didn't get to put it in the video game. The people should know. What the fucking presidential limo! Fuck off! <laughs> Don't mean to alarm anyone, but the S Blade, you think it has a hack blood charge? It literally does not. No. You're banned. You are banned forever. Okay, we should go check out Giant Floating Head. So, no Giant Floating Head? Well, on the contrary. I think there'll be quite a lot of Giant Floating Head to go around. For anyone interested. For all intrigued parties. There's yummy goodies over there. I don't want to get that. So I'm going to go get yummy goodies. Oh, this door locked. Damn, this door fucking locked. Uh... Could I fall down? Oh, I could fall down. I did earlier. What if I did it again? Oh, I literally can't pick up any of these. I'm a damn fool. Awesome. Hey man. Good to see you. Hanging out. This is the capital. It was going to explode after a psycho head crushes it, and a bunch of psychos were going to fall out of it. S for seepage. I also didn't think about that. I also assumed it was S for slayers. <laughs> Fuck, that's really good. <laughs> I hadn't thought of that. It won't budge. It won't budge. Ow! Ow! Through the wall? mentioned this at all during the stream. I've been playing uh, some Deep Rock Galactic again in my free time, just because I've, I've had a hankering to play DRG again. Man, what a good video game. But the problem is, that is an FPS. That is an FPS where the mechanic is there's darkness, and you can deal with the darkness by throwing flares and stuff. Now the problem is, anytime I play any other FPS, I'm like, oh shit, it's dark here, I better throw a flare out. And I press F and nothing happens. Well, in this game, I flip the bird. Huge thanks for the shout out. I mean, hey, you, you do cool, good, interesting work. You're out here supporting me. At least I can fucking do is, you know, be like, hey, if you like my shit. Go check this shit cents? out. It's also cool. What a ripoff! Just shoot it! And I was very wise today and I showed restraint. Uh, 
and I didn't play any Deep Rock Galactic, because I knew if I did, I would get sucked in uh, and just be playing that for the rest of the day and just my own damn stream. And I'm glad I didn't, because this game is really goddamn good. Oh, hey, there's a fucking maze here. Open up the prison. Jail. Where's the door? I forgot where the door is. I walked past it. What? The X-Rayer. <laughs> what is the scream? <sighs> All right. That is all the bonus levels. That's all the bonus levels of Slayer's X. We did it. Boise, Idaho is safe forever. But it can never be taken away from us. Man. What a game. What a fucking game. Did we see the art easter egg? You're gonna have to be a little more specific than that. What do you mean? <laughs> the one about his kid? I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember, but I think maybe now. I'm sure there's plenty of things I missed. There's plenty of secrets I didn't catch in all the levels. Would not be surprised if there was some more neat little goodies about, like, the universe uh, and the characters in one of those. Some of Zane's kids' baby drawings are in a secret. Aw, that's cute. Aw. <sighs> oh, damn, I'm only missing a couple achievements. He says something like pretty good for a three-year-old? That's fucking awesome. <laughs> I mean, I'll certainly go and look for it on my own time. I do already want to like dip in and find all the find all the secrets. Probably like look up a if there's a guide or some hints about it or anything like that. I not on stream. <laughs> <sighs> Didn't he add the option to turn Gore off for his kid? Awesome. His son's name is Mikey? Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. Um. So I only have a couple achievements left. One of which is for... Uh, presumably playing the game on Insane difficulty, because it's just called Insane. An achievement description of your freaking Insane. Uh, the one for giving cheese to... The rats. 
and then one just called No Pooping Allowed. Description of Oops, I broke all the toilets in the game. I broke a lot of toilets in that game. But I guess I wasn't thorough enough. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm going to have to hand in my streamer badge and gun. I'm, I'm officially retiring. No more from me. Got every other achievement, though, so that's pretty good. I, I, I got the ski baller one. I got the hole in one. I blew up the potato cowboys. <laughs> Streamer Holly soft on toilets. That's the thing that people are always famously saying about me. That's the one thing people famously always say about me. That's what everyone is always saying about me, is that it's really a shame that for all the hardline stances I will take on stream, for all the 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 the, the puffering and and posturing I will do, I will not take a firm hardline stance on toilets. Everyone's always saying that about me. Everyone's always so ashamed of me because of that. It's that thing everyone's always famously saying. What the fuck am I talking about? It's two in the morning. <laughs> Y'all, I'm tired. Y'all, I'm, I'm so tired. <laughs> I don't know how I'm still awake right now. <laughs> um, I'm going to be doing an art stream tomorrow. Um, probably a little bit later in the afternoon than when I originally scheduled, but I do still have commissions that people paid for that I want to get through. Sketch commissions. Uh, so I want to get back to doing that. We'll do some of that tomorrow. It already is tomorrow? Sure, if you want to be... Uh... What's the word? What's the word? Uh, if you want to be pedantic about it, yeah. But I haven't gone to bed yet. I don't count. I... <laughs> I was trying to remember the word pedantic. But because I'm tired, I was... the. The thing that was immediately coming to mind was me going, yeah, sure, if you want to be a stretched asshole about it, that doesn't mean anything. That doesn't mean anything! <laughs> That's nothing! <laughs> Let's look at some fan art. <laughs> Let's look at some fan art. <laughs> Let's look at some fan art. <laughs> this is from when I did the stream of the, the Nintendo whatever. And I talked about new, new Mario Super. It almost makes me go to bed. Awesome. Thanks for that. <laughs> Big fan of the bah bah in the speech bubble. Thanks, I love Baba. Uh, again, I have streamer mode on, so I can't see the names of most people who submitted things, but... Fucking awesome. <laughs> Very cute. Very cute. Um, I'm addicted to... <laughs> Don't know why I drew Holly type of Goomba. <laughs> really good sentence. Thank you for that. Well, this one, it says it's from Lonely Wizard. I'm hardcore. I'm hardcore. I'm a hard woman. I can't fly, but I am hard. Fucking awesome. I have to react to this with my with my fuck yes sirs. Um Yes, 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 yes. Yes. Awesome. Thank you. Uh, this one here. Now I know this one. I recognize this art style. That's Elk Turtle. Oh, man. We were fucking grilling, weren't we? By fucking God. I bet you can't guess what I'm grilling. Bet you can't guess what I'm grilling. Thank you very much. Very cute. Uh, this one... Well, the rhino's there. <laughs> I don't know if this is necessarily so super fitting for the fan art channel, but thanks, I suppose. This one, though, also from the same user. Very cool. Fuck yeah. 
You'll love to see it. Yay! <laughs> Thank you very much. This is awesome. It's quite cool. That. I reckon we'll do it. Uh, unless there's something cool on Twitter. Let's see. Uh, check really quick. Oh, fuck, I sleepy. <laughs> I was gonna say, I haven't stayed up this late in a while, but literally, no, I have stayed up this late for a while, and it's been a problem. My sleep schedule's been fucked. Did the RTVS Buru go anywhere? I don't know. I think one of us was just, like, hosting it, but also, like, no one was really using it. People are just posting things on, like, Discord and stuff. Holly, self-care, please. Man, don't fucking hun me. I'm 28. I'm a goddamn adult. I know how to take care of myself, and I know how to take responsibility for my damn decisions. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Still up, but no new posts. Wild. I've been trying to get back to sleep in a midnight sign. Uh. Trying. Being the keyword here. Oh, this is great music for me talking about my fucked sleep schedule. Uh. <laughs> um. But. Sometimes you have trouble falling asleep, and sometimes you have trouble making the brain turn off, and so you just go, oh, what if I just stay up for a little bit more and look at some stuff, and then it's like, oh, fuck, it's like three in the morning now. Happens to me sometimes. Uh, hopefully, rest of this week I can wrangle that into something more ship-shaped, more reasonable. Uh, but also, uh, I imagine I might <laughs> be up late a little bit again for Thursday stream, unless, well, I, I was told my house is quite short. Um, and I know there was like a readme that I checked out and I was like, oh yeah, this is like, you know, a 10-15 minute walkthrough thing, which is like part of the fiction of it and not, not true. But even then, I've heard it's like, you know, a couple hours at most, which, um, given the way I play video games, I'm, I'm like doubling that in my head. <laughs> so. That'll be a fun couple hours. I might end up being up a little late for that again. We'll see. And then fucking Saturday's Pig. Who goddamn knows how long it's gonna take to get through the Peppa Pig video game? <laughs> I can't believe I'm sitting here saying a sentence like that again. But, uh, that'll be fun. That'll be fun. I beat this way faster than you, though? Huh. Wild. I feel like I played through it pretty damn slow. Which I tend to. I've made my peace with it. I, I like being methodical. But yeah, uh, for anyone being like, wait, what the fuck? About any of the schedule things I've said, check out the schedule on uh, Discord or on Twitter or on Tumblr. I post it there. Uh, I, I tend to post my schedule stuff like a week in advance so you know uh, what's, what's going on. But I guess for the sake of it... Um, as long as nothing happens, because they're they are calling for big storms in my area. Haven't actually happened yet. So maybe we're, we've passed the worst of it, but I'm still anticipating something. Um tomorrow afternoon, uh, I'm doing more art. Thursday evening, playing my house.wad. There's a neat Doom 2 
uh, mod that people have been raving about. Friday uh, afternoon, read more Dracula. Uh, and then Game Clam's happening. Saturday, Peppa Pig. Sad that you're one of the few RTS members who promote on Tumblr? What's... What's sad about it? The fact that I do it or the fact that other people don't? The only reason I post, like, the streams and stuff on Tumblr was because people asked me to do it. Literally, when I was first streaming, I would be posting my stream announcements on Tumblr, like, every time. And, like, no one would engage with them. And so I figured, well, people aren't really seeing or interacting with this. People don't necessarily seem like they want it. So what if I just didn't? And so I didn't. And it had no marked change on my viewership or anything. And so I kept not doing it. And then after a while, a couple of years of oh, this fucking song. Oh. Train of thought completely derailed. Sinar Wild Hearts. You have to stand for the national anthem. You have to rise for the national anthem. Oh, I fucking love this song. <laughs> I'm trying so hard not to cry. It's two in the morning and I'm a little emotional. <laughs> I fucking love this song. Right to my fucking meatball. You're right, sign. So long. Oh, it's goodbye first. So long after that. Sayonara! Ugh, I need to remember what the lyrics of this song are so I can actually sing it someday. It's like my secret dream, and you get to know about this because I'm feeling feisty uh, on, on Little Sleep, but someday I want to try my hand at like singing through uh, that game soundtrack. What a good fucking soundtrack. Oh. Oh. Anyways, um, the only reason I started doing it again was because someone straight up messaged me and was like, Hey, why don't you post alert, like announcements on, on, on Tumblr anymore? And that was kind of around the point where I decided I don't really want to spend time on Twitter.com if I can help it. I'll like go on sometimes to see what like people I know are talking about. Other than that, I just go on and talk about my job. Um... And so that was when I was kind of like, you know, using Tumblr more than I was. Um, and I was like, oh, huh, well, I guess I'm using this website again. Is that a thing people would want? Is that a thing people would be interested in? Is that something that people would want to engage with? Uh, overwhelming answer being, yeah, I'd, a lot of people going, yeah, I'd like that. And so I did. And then I realized you can just straight up embed a Twitch stream in a Tumblr post. And so I was like, eh, fuck it, whatever. You're scrolling down your damn dashboard, you see my damn stream. <laughs> Look at my stream, boy. <laughs> so, uh, I just kind of started doing that again. You can? Yeah, I was fucking surprised when I learned that, Kimmy. I was like, wait, what? Why? Huh. Probably go back to Tumblr within the year at that rate. Twitter is a fucking pile. Well, Tumblr and its management is a pile for different reasons, but I certainly have uh, more fun looking at that website for a couple minutes every day or two, more so than looking at Twitter. So, uh, <laughs> I, I'm a social media hater. I don't really enjoy using social media. I kind of frankly hate using social media. Um, I like co-host. I look at co-host also uh, every couple of days. Specifically, I like the idea of using co-host just for posting long form stuff because I like the formatting better for posting long form stuff. Uh, I haven't had the time to sit down and write long form stuff recently, which has made me a little sad because I, I've had the hankering, but it's fun to do that. Um, Co-host is neat because it seems like a website designed to do away with the shit I hate about social media. 
Uh, and Tumblr is I'm already on there. I'm like a damn leech. Uh, I've, I'm, I'm a mushroom. I've moved in. I've planted my mycelia. I'm there. And so it's fun to look at those two. Every now and then. Reddit thing. Sorry, I'm gonna end stream soon, but I'm just kind of talking at this point. The the fucking Reddit thing happened where a bunch of people were like, um... Oh man, all of these refugees coming over from 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 Reddit to, to Tumblr. I can't, I can't believe this is happening. So many of them. I haven't seen a single fucking one. I haven't seen a single fucking one. So many posts about it happening. So, so many roundabout posts about the thing that is allegedly happening. Literally, I've never seen it happen. And there have been so many times where people talk insistently about some event, or something, uh, and then talking in circles about the people talking about that thing, and people talking about the people talking about that thing, etc, etc, etc. And I never actually see the thing. Like this. I'm seeing the I'm seeing the fucking smoke trails of boats long sailed past. It's easier to have opinions about hypothetical people. I try not to. I think it's a bad habit to get into that I find myself falling into sometimes, and I think I don't know. People joke about making up a guy to get mad at. But man, people some people do actually do that sometimes. Fuck. It's sometimes I find myself doing that sometimes, and I gotta stop myself and think, this isn't real. You know? <laughs> what's, what's the point of make, getting mad about a thing that might be, could be, but isn't? What if the world was made of pudding? Here's a story from North America. Daddy, 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 hurry, I saw something scurry, etc, etc. I wonder how many people out there don't know that What If The World Was Made Of Pudding is from a song. And like an animation. And isn't just like something that someone glibly said on like Tumblr or whatever. It's a... It's, it's a quote. Was it really? Yeah, all right, here's... It's two in the morning. I'm pulling up YouTube. I'm pulling up YouTube. Um, I'm putting it on the overlay. And you're all gonna watch Story from North America with me. And you're finally gonna understand uh, what I fucking mean when I say, What if the world was made of pudding? Okay. It's moved to the fucking side. Why? <laughs> Hang on. Okay, that's better. Bring down the sound a little bit. Here's a story from North America. This is a fucking classic. This is old. It's great. It's a legend. If 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 any of you from like Canada who like fuck with the National Film Board remember shit like the cat came back and Blackfly. This is like 2000s internet version of that to me. It's not actually a National Film Board thing, but it reminds me so much of those. I also don't know if this was made in Canada, but it does have that stink of Canadian media. And I mean that in a positive way at this specific venture. Anyways. Son, what's all this screaming for? You're gonna wake the neighbors next door. Daddy, I think there's a spider on my floor. Is it? And will you squish it? Night to come into your room and destroy life. Is 
that what they teach you in Sunday school. But Daddy, it's gross. It's got a million legs, a billion eyes, a trillion eggs. Son, it's not disgusting. It's just reality. Take a deep breath and appreciate life. I forgot he jams his whole fucking arm in his mouth. I forgot he did that. That's one of the best parts of the video, and I forgot he did that. <laughs> uh, message in chat saying, Honestly thought, what if the world was made of pudding was purely from that one Neil Cesariga Tumblr ask? No, Neil Cesariga was referencing this video. Becoming human. Let's return him to his natural habitat. Put him in a cup and take him outside. Godspeed. And that's a story from North America. From 2007. Classic. Fucking classic. If, if ever you hear me say something along the lines of like, what if the world was made of pudding? Or put him in a cup and throw him outside, Godspeed. That's what I'm referencing. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Really good video about understanding your place in the world and also learning respect for all the weird things you see in the world and also not fucking making up a guy to get mad at. Story of spiders. Empathy grows as we learn. Exactly. Thank you, Brady. <laughs> and also, you can eat your arm if it's covered in enough pudding. But you probably shouldn't.
But you probably shouldn't. I guess that's the stream, huh? <laughs> I guess that's where we call the stream for tonight, huh? Man. Man, oh man. Good stream. <laughs> Very cool video game. Genuinely... Literally, even knowing that we're getting Net Settler, as it stands, as it stands, Slayer's X, genuinely... Such a good fucking follow-up to Hypnospace Outlaw. Oh, man. Take a break tomorrow? Oh, no, I'm streaming. Uh, tomorrow afternoon, probably. Unless I'm too tired. We'll see. We'll see. If I call off, that's why. <laughs> such, a, such a cool little video game. And I'm glad we got to share it all together. Thank you all so much for your support tonight. All the subs, all the tips, all the bits. I do always appreciate your support and your generosity. Uh, these streams would not be possible, and certainly would not be what they are, uh, without the very generous support of viewers like you. So thank you all very much. Thank you as well for all the wonderful fan art. Thank you for all the raids we had today. Uh, thank you for all the follows we had. Again, I, thank you to any new folks who stopped on by. And thank you all very much for tuning in. You know, whether you were here for the whole stream or just for a little bit, whether you only hopped in at the start or you just checked in now right at the end, uh, whether you've been lurking or you've been chatting with, with folks and with me, whether you're catching this live or you're checking out the VOD, it's always wonderful to have you here. It is always a delight and a pleasure to get to share and talk about stuff like this with you. So thanks for taking time out of your busy day to spend it here with us. We're raiding my friend Bugs. Bugs and Frankie, who are live right now. Uh, I think they're playing... Mother 3? That sounds like a good time. That sounds like a good time. Go, uh, go ahead and check that out if you want to check out more cool late night streams. Uh, Bugs and Frankie are a wonderful bunch and I always love to realistically catch up on their VODs when I can because they do stream a little late for me, but that's time zones for you. Go give them a look. They're great folks. Uh, unless I'm too tired, we'll see. Unless I'm too tired, stream tomorrow. We're doing some more art. If not tomorrow, I'll probably squeeze it in Sunday or something. We'll see. Maybe I'll see you then. Or maybe I'll see you around some other time, but no matter what happens before we head off, I'd just like to say have a wonderful rest of your evening. Thank you all very much for tuning in. Make sure you're taking care of yourselves and taking care of the folks around you. And I hope we see you again soon. Good night. <laughs>